Hello. So, we're back. This is day three. Just leave this gym real quick. Okay, it takes a while to leave this gym. Never mind. I hope you're doing well. Yo, someone already playing add LMAO. We'll do it in a bit. We'll do it in a, in a little bit. Damn, level two, that's fast. Yeah, it's zooming, master. Thanks for the prime. Photo, thanks for the prime. OG engine, thanks for the three months. Appreciate the support. Twilight Stripes, thank you as well. Stream overlay is different. It is. It's we're playing a uh, Pokemon uh, Di Diamond, so it has two screens. We have a screen there. My oh god, my hand is not looking good, is it? And we have a screen here. See? Wait, is the camera mirrored? I think this is right. I think this is fine. I think the camera is mirrored. Or is not mirrored. Got a little sponsor thing in the corner now? Yeah, it's for, for Panda. It's it's cool. I haven't got all my, my HyperX gear yet, but I'm excited to get it, honestly. Let's, let's move that, like... Yeah, yeah, that's fine. That'll be fine. You can't sub because you have no money? Hey, don't worry about it. Don't worry, just watch the stream. It's all good, man. Usually you look left, now you're looking right. I know, it's crazy, isn't it? It's interesting how that works. Ren, thanks for the Prime. J Killer, Vice of Virtue, thanks for the eight months. What the heck? Wait, what did Cynthia just say? I wasn't paying attention. Anyways, we just got the fifth badge. Uh, fifth badge in Diamond is the Ghost Lady. Uh, but I'm gonna show you guys how this challenge works. You can see, oh, we should probably visit the Pokemon Center first. Uh, Pokemon Center first. Does subbing with Prime still give me the full amount like a regular sub does? Yes. If you, it, it's great. Twitch Prime is great. If you use Twitch Prime, effectively it's free if you already have Amazon Prime. And I still get paid the exact same amount. It's great. You're just taking money away from Amazon and giving it to me. It's fantastic. Addo, thanks for the Prime. Alexander, thanks for the Prime as well. Appreciate the support. Timer? Oh yeah, we need a timer, right. Oh heck, that's where the timer usually goes. Hmm. Let's do this. No, not that one. Ah. There we go. Little thing on the bottom there, I like it. Okay, uh, uh, how far in are we again? How many hours in? 10 hours, 200 hours, 7 hours, I don't know. We're at 8 minutes in, 20 minutes in, okay. That's about right. Get to level 4? I mean, we're at level 4. I think we're at level 5 now. Whew. Just put it outside the stream. We're not at 38 hours, I don't know. The King. Art, thanks for the Prime, appreciate it. 10 hours? Alright. I, I trust Yo-Yo the most. Yo-Yo is always my my time my timer man. Okay, so we're ten hours into this. I have five badges, and I will show you how this works right now. You can see our team. We got a, a Weeping Bell, Rampardos, Cast Form. Um, I mean, let's look at the names. Look, we got Turnip at sign, Creator of the Mud. Thank you so much at sign. Pretzel, Ash, Zoe, and Emily. That's our team. And then we go into battle. And we see him a chop, whatever. We send out turnip, it's still a weeping bell. We run. And then we walk around a little bit and look at that. Our team is a mighty Anna. And a Psyduck. And there we go. It's random, every single battle. Just let me do the YouTube intro, guys. I know it's 1045. Come on. I know, I read chat. I was just trying to do the YouTube intro. It's gonna look bad if the time for this is wrong. No one's gonna notice. No one's gonna notice. But anyways, that's the challenge. That's what we're doing. Skylo, Easter Bunny, thanks for the subs. Yo, the Easter Bunny sub. Uh, I guess since we have five badges now, we can just go and rush. Oh, okay. 
Uh, since we have five badges now, we can just rush the sixth gym, rush the seventh gym, uh, take out that diamond thing, and then uh, the alga, that's the diamond thing, and then beat the game. We might be able to beat the game today, we'll see. Uh, okay, we have someone that can learn fly, excellent. I'm gonna teach it right now. I could have prevented this by saying hi to you. Hello, Abby. Volblight, Lava, thanks for the gift subs, appreciate it. Nine months fart chicken, thanks so much. Okay, which move should be forgotten? It really doesn't matter, we're not gonna keep this for more than the battle. Uh, our team is a little bit under leveled at the moment. Um, so what I think we might go and do is we might do Iron Islands to level up a little bit. I'll see, cause like, Riley is a really good way to grind. With Riley and the Iron Islands, that would make it way faster. Because, like, I'm six badges in, and my highest level Pokemon is level... 28. We should have, like, mid-30s to almost 40s by now. So, we'll have to figure that out, for sure. Profitable, thanks for the 11 months, almost a year. Had hey, you ever get sponsored? No, that's... Re why, why would... Why would you... No. Why would you even think that? Uh, I don't know how to say your name. Captain, I think. Thanks for the prime. You need to eat a fish? What kind of fish? Is this cyberpunk? No. <laughs> I didn't play cyberpunk. I don't need that cyber... A nice halibut. Janna, Le Levy, Levi, thanks for the primes. Appreciate it. Sports fan, thanks for the prime. Redstone Geek, thanks for the Prime. Stein, thanks for the Prime. Did someone come to my chat, like a huge streamer, just walk over and be like, hey, use your Primes on this dude. Is that what's going on right now? Cause like, I just got like, five, seven Primes all at once. Did like a big streamer be like, go sub, use your Primes on this. This, 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 this kid. He's, he's a good streamer, he's up and coming. Oh my god, surfing is so slow in Diamond, I forgot. Yikes. Swift, thanks for the tier one. Becca, thanks for the prime. Wilba, thanks, or Wil... Yeah, Wilba, thanks for the prime. Alpine, thanks for the tier one. Big Sus, one time, thanks for the prime. Young Warlock with the prime. This is what I mean, this is insane. For the sake of me, Leston, Disco Dennis, James the Potato with all the subs, it's absurd. We don't need no tent. This is a wild tentacle. It is level 28. If I catch it, it will be my strongest Pokemon. Hmm. Hmm. I'm pretty sure we can catch up to level 40s right now, though. Standard Weep, thanks for the prime. Humanic. Potato Fusion. Thanks for the subs. Hard case, thanks for the prime. Okay. Boop. Uh, okay, we're good. We'll just run into the city and... What is this? Hello, my friend? I want- yeah, who the hell are you? He's upgraded my Pokédex. Why didn't they just give me this to start? It's so weird. I don't know why they just didn't give this to start. You're in 420 XP? Nice. So, we're in this city, and I think to go across the bridge we will have to fight the man? I don't know if we can take the man. Maybe we'll give it a try. I don't know. Uh, what was our starter again? Was it the... I'm trying to remember what the man has. I think our starter was the water one. I think we picked Piplup. You can get level 40s with surfing. It's a good idea. It's a very good idea. Let, let's just see if I can defeat the man. Let's just go for it. Where do you find the randomizer? It's not available yet. Gloom, Vile Plume... Torkoal. 
and a pretzel. Okay, this this should be fine. We'll, we'll be we'll, we'll beat the man. We can we can do this. Yeah, we're fine. Pretzel is a great name for a Dodrio. Yeah, all the heads all tangled up. Oh, the Staravia is level thirty-one. Okay. Um. You, we, mm, as long as this doesn't know sand attack, I think we can win. Yeah, I think we can win here. Because we have curse. Because, like, all we need to do is just curse, like, six times. Right? We can just curse. And then we can curse again. And it's gonna do its absolute best, but that's not gonna do much. Yeah. Curse again, we're good. You shouldn't curse on stream, that's bad. Yeah, it might not be good for YouTube. Yeah, unless he crits. No, no, I'm too lucky for that. There's no no chance at a crit. Let's. Do I actually have... Yeah. I have the, m the milk. Sorry, the milk. I have the milk. Turnip drinks the milk. And then we're fine. No problem. It uses Aerial Ace, it does like four damage. And this level 26 Torkoal might sweep their team. Now, the one thing I'm scared of is if they have a special move, like like a water type special move, that would suck, but we'll see how it goes. Hmm. <sighs> Turnip's defense rose. We're almost at plus six. It's gonna try and take me down. Does nothing, of course. Hit with recoil. Attack, bro? No. He has a float soul, but does float soul know a special water move? That's the thing. Because we're raising our defense. Unnamed man. Thank you for the two subs. Appreciate the support. Okay, so that is six curses. It's gonna double team. That sucks, but that's not too bad as long as it's not sand attacking. Might have water pulse. Well, we might be able to survive a single water pulse. Floats on those dragon rage. Something about that doesn't seem right. Didn't you just say he has a piplup? No, we have a piplup. So I'm gonna use this milk. It's gonna try and take me down. It's gonna do no damage. Look at that, seven HP. And I believe Fire Spin is a physical move, so we can just Fire Spin. Blot and Bees, thanks for the two. And this should be a one-hit KO? Fire spin is special. We're gonna have to use rapid spin. I was mixing it up with um, flame wheel. I believe flame wheel is physical. Let's try rapid spin, which is just horrendous. Whooper for life, thanks for the five gifted subs, dude. Okay, rapid spin, how much is this gonna do? It's a somewhat respectable amount of damage, but we now have to use Rapid Spin, which is basically an 80 base power move. It's uh, honestly trash. It's just terrible. But Flame Wheel should take that out. Now they will send out Floatzel next. And I'm not quite sure, or a Buizel, sorry, not even a Floatzel. This should be easy. Because, like, it's gonna what, like Aqua Jet or something, right? Quick attack. What is it doing? That does nothing. And look at this rapid spin. Boom, that's a really disappointing amount of damage. A really disappointing. I don't know why it's using quick attack as opposed to, you know, uh, like, a water move. 
Aqua Jet is four times effective? That's crazy. Really? I didn't realize his turnip was double fire type. Does it, is it like two fire types like stacked on top of each other? Is it like super fire, which is why water is four times as effective? Is that... Is that what that is, or...? My turnip is in attack mode. <laughs> I'm just gonna heal this just in case. He's not a fire rock type, he's just a base fire type. When will the ad be played? Oh, that's a good idea. Let's do it now. Okay. And you know what? We'll do this as well. We took it out. Easy. Bweasel. More like Bweezy. <laughs> Oh, it's not funny. Okay. I'm getting a call from FedEx. Give me a sec. Hello, this is a FedEx automated customer satisfaction survey. <sighs> Thought I was getting a package or something. I was so excited. All right, Grottle, more like, I don't know. He's, he's, he's gone. Oh, uh, Leech Seed, that actually kind of sucks quite a lot. Kind of a lot. So Leech Seed does uh, quite a number actually, and Fire Spin missed. Wow, Fire Spin sucks. A tier three, Tim, Timless Tim. Thank you so much. Hey, what's up, Fed? Did I wait? Did I miss again? I'm not. I haven't been paying attention. Did I miss two Fire Spins, or have I flinched? I must have flinched. Wait, can I rapid spin the leech seed? Wait, does rapid spin affect leech seed in this gen? Does it? Does it? I blew away the leech seed. Let's go. Okay, okay. It tries leech seed again, does nothing. Let's go. Fire spin. It missed. <sighs> well, uh... Why make a move this bad? 15 power with 70% accuracy? It's sh <sighs> Why make a move that's that bad? I just don't get it. I just don't get it. I just want to deal some chip damage, but he can't hit a fire spin! There we go. <sighs> there we go. Now I dealt a little, a little tiny bit of damage. Okay, well now the fire spin is down. Now we rapid spin. This turtle just... He do be spinning. And we flinched, but we get some chip damage. That's good. Uh, yeah, we can hit another rapid spin. Okay, we missed a razor leaf. That's fine. Just two turtles fighting to the death. Don't... Don't worry about it. Uh, you know what? I'll heal again. Let's use my super potion. No milk this time. Need to get rid of the, su the super potions. Kazita, thanks for the primes. Thanks for the five bucks, by the way, car. Oh, wait, is this... It's fine. Hope you have a nice day. Sorry you can't watch your streams. Hey, that's alright, car. It's Bork. Thanks for the 641. 
This is your commission as a nightlight? Thank you. Thank you so much. I look crisp today. Thank you. Leech seed? Don't worry about it, turnip. We're just gonna spin that bad boy right off. My turtle is spinning. This is a plus six, by the way. This is a plus six max attack rapid spin. What's up with that, huh? It's doing barely anything. Like, we're, we've used Curse six times. So what's up with that? Come on, wrap it's been away. He didn't use a potion, that's good. I'm really glad he didn't use a potion. I didn't even consider that he might, but he didn't. So turn up the level 26 Torkoal is continuing to sweep, and this is why we don't need to level up. Cohen, thank you for the gift sub to Crafter. And, uh, Dennis, thanks for the gift sub as well. To Turtle Combat. <laughs> Snack, thanks for the Prime. Uh, I don't know what's coming out, but it, it cannot... Okay, yeah, Ponyta. It's nothing. It's nothing. Vilified, thanks for the Tier 1. We'll just Rapid Spin again. It's gonna stomp me. Just try and flinch. Just try to flinch me. That's right. It won't. Does the man even use potions? I don't know. Find out. What an easy W, dude. What an easy W. Are you doing well in the challenge? I'm doing fantastic. Honestly, we might be able to finish this challenge today, because it's like... Uh, it's like three badges that are all pretty easy to get to. And then the Elite Four, but also some story. But like, we can do that. Like, you know, one of those things an hour. We'll get a badge in the first hour, get a, another badge in the next hour, we'll do some story progression for another hour, last badge for an hour, and then the Elite Four takes like 20 minutes. Right? Easy. Spinning away. You just want to finish so you can play Minecraft after? Maybe. Maybe not. We'll see. I'll have you know I did a single Minecraft run this morning. Where I started the run, and I was like, I'm just gonna do one run, the first seed that I try. Just, just before stream starts. I got 27 iron within three minutes. I was in the nether in five minutes. I spawned next to a fortress. I got all of the blaze rods within the next three minutes. I had full iron armor, or almost full iron armor. And then I wasted 25 minutes trying to trade for pearls. Pretty sad. Night Slash Heracross. Sure, it might get a crit, but that's nothing. Oh, got a crit. It's nothing. No big deal. Tor Torkoal the Turnip can take it. There's a reason why I wasn't afraid and... For, about crits? This is fine. Turnip can take it. Turnip is permanent sturdy no matter what health it's at. It's like constantly enduring. It's great. Brick break? Nothing. Your best chance is Night Slash Heracross, and you need like an ultra crit to take me out at this point. <laughs> Mr. Reckless Gamer thanks for the 9. Look at this. Look at this. No damage. Boom. Night Slash. Not a problem. See? Nothing. He knows Night Slash is his only hope, but... It's- he doesn't have any hope. There's nothing. It's- it's inevitable, my man. It is inevitable, Heracross. You're going down. That's a crit on the Aerial Ace. Okay. Just shows how good Melk is. We're not done yet, neither me nor my Pokemon are give, have given up. That's too bad. You would- if you just gave up now, you could say, Oh, I didn't try my best, or something, man. You know, I, I wasn't- I wasn't trying. I wasn't actually trying. It doesn't count. You should- you should just do that. It, it's- it's much easier. 
on your ego. Is it fire super effective? It is, but it's gonna do less than rapid spin because, I mean, I'll show you how much damage it does. That's how much damage it does. And that's why we're not using fire spin. It just doesn't hit. Whereas rapid spin hits 100% of the time and is fantastic. Alright, turnip took him out. Turnip carried. You guys said we were under leveled. It's ridiculous. I just had a level 27 turtle take out a whole team of like level 30 pluses. Turnip wants to use Flamethrower. That would have been nice to have for this battle, you know? Instead of having a base 15 power with 70% accuracy move, we could instead have... We could instead have, have had... You know, a base 95 power, 100% accuracy move. That would have been really great. That would have been fantastic. But now it's gone forever, because we're not going to have this turtle anymore. Glad you like it, Fed. We're going to we beat the man. Alright. Yeah, you're just a bit better than me? No, I literally destroyed you with a single Pokemon, man. Get out of here. Go away. That's right. Alright, let's go get strength. Alright, let's go. Chaco Chaco, thanks for the tier one. Appreciate the support and lazy dingo, thanks for the prime. Yeah, I learned flamethrower for the steel type gym, exactly. Alright, Riley, my man, my man, my man. We gotta have a talk. Uh we do we not even meet Riley yet? Oh, we gotta go through this area a little bit alone first. This is fine. I definitely know the path to take the first try. For sure. Grind time? No, 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 no. We don't, we, we don't gotta grind, okay? We're just gonna go through this normally. Everything will be fine. It's all chill. See, I'm curious. That team looks terrible. It does look like some hot garbage. But we'll see. Let's see what we got. Turnip? Igly buff. With attack drop. Just kiss it, I guess. Wow. Okay. Emily, it's basically up to you. Emily is pretty strong. Emily does have metronome for the maximum randomness. And uh, you're gonna get um, head charge or something, or whatever that move is called. Yeah, facade, of course. That's not bad, that's stab. Yeah, that does a good amount of damage. Head smash, yeah, head smash, right. It's gonna use head smash, the real strong rock move. Look at that, acid. So good. That actually didn't do... It did more than I thought it was going to. Endeavor, that's gonna lower my health to, what, 32? 31. I was close. It was a good guess. We're not gonna get explosion. This everything will be fine. Defend order. Interesting. Defense and special defense boosted. I'm down for that. Can you get trapped in an HM situation? No, we have a fix for that just in case. We can uh, always fix it. It's always self destruct explosion. It won't be. It'll be fine. Level 10. Thanks to the Prime. Third Dino Master and Fed to carry. Thanks for the subs. And so, Slicer, thank you as well. Okay, we have Defend ordered, and I figured, you know what? Might as well keep it alive then. Metronome again. It's going to Endeavor. That's taking me down to 31. Yikes. Ingrain. Interesting. Interesting. So now we can't switch Emily out. Uh... This Saravia just keeps endeavoring. Metronome, Trick Room. 
I guess we're faster now? Emily is just setting up. Trick room, defend order, ingrain. What is Emily planning? Emily is planning to miss a magma storm. That would have been a good move to hit, Emily, but you didn't. Emily is setting up for a single Fury Cutter. Okay. Does this Staravia know that Endeavor doesn't really do anything if you just keep using it over and over again? Oh, that does a, that's a fair amount. Okay. Emily used Spite, getting rid of those quick attacks. Okay, I see you, Emily. I see you. We only have two metronomes left, Emily. You're getting low on HP, Emily. Thunder Wave, okay. I still believe in you. Think we can survive this hit? I feel like we can't. I'm just gonna use this, but it's gonna get paralyzed anyways. Yep. Okay, Emily, this is your last metronome. Another Magma Storm! Emily wanted another try at it. Okay. Damn. We'll take that. Emily leveling up. That's what we like to see. Ingrain getting some HP back. Emily is all set up. Cherim keep battling. Oh, Magma Storm would have been great for this Cherim. That's fine. We're just going to sing. We're just going to sing. Oh god, the Cherim transformed into a... To reveal itself, and it sung. Minimize setup? I don't need to. Here's what we're gonna do. We will simply... Slap it to death. We're just gonna slap it to death. Okay? Cherim, get slapped. Never mind. Emily, you gotta, you gotta slap, please. Thank you. Okay. That does not do a lot of damage, but if we hit five hits, that'll do a decent amount. I Critical hit, nice. It keeps going. Triple slap. Triple slap, got it. Phantom, thanks for the five months, appreciate it. Use the leech seed. I have ingrain and leech seed. I basically already leech seeded myself, Cherim. What are you doing? Okay. Wait, did leech seed not do anything? Did I miss something? Or did leech seed not hit? Oh, we have magic guard. Oh, so leech seed just does nothing. Nice! Emily is all set up. Yeah, go back into your little... Your little flowery shell, dude. Like, Barrow, thanks for the 16, Pog. Critical hit. Very nice. One more. Hey, look at that. Emily's so strong. Oops, those are my Joy-Cons. Alright, it's pretty good. Pretty good. Oh, no, that's... Graveler. What's that sign? Can that sign take this? Yes, that sign can. You can do it, that sign. Good job, at sign. Good, good job. Go, Zoe. Zoe. Go, Zoe, you can do it. Good job. Whoa. 
Okay, that was a crit. Good job, Zoe! <clears throat> Use next Pokemon, let's go! Uh, Pretzel! Pretzel, Magnitude. Rock Blast, yikes. Good job, Pretzel. Go Ash. You got the you got this Ash. Just out speed. Magnitude six. That's not gonna take me out, right? This Graveler is not gonna take out my entire team. No, it won't. We're good. No problem. No problem at all. See? Easy. Okay, my Pokemon might be a little underleveled. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Oh, there's another one. We have a Squirtle, though. Bubble Beam. Water Pulse. That'll do. Use Rollout. That's gonna do nothing. It's gonna do, like, four damage. It's like four damage. It's nothing. Squirtle's got this. Look. Look at how much damage that does. Woo! One hit KO. We had the torrent boosted water pulse from Ash. Beautiful. Just a magnificent. Yo, Squirtle is evolving. Ash. Okay. We got an evolution. Impressive. Would you look at that? Yo, War Turtle looks a little bit different in this generation, doesn't it? Cool. War Turtle used a Harden, apparently. Oh my god, all of these Gravelers are so annoying. Get out of here. Go away. Okay, this will take three hits. Okay, well, that's not gonna take me out. Metagross is sky high defense, right? We have one Pokemon left. We'll be fine. We're okay. It's not a big deal. We just gotta- we just gotta make it to this elevator without encountering anything because we have a Ralts. Is Riley left or right? Okay, you're Riley, but I would be training here. We could team up. We're fine. If your Pokemon get hurt, I'll heal them up. If you could help me out, like, right now, that'd be great. Riley? Okay. That is a Steelix and a Graveler. And he did not heal my team. Okay, we have a Magical Leaf for Graveler. We can't run from wild Pokemon. We can't run. Not r no running allowed. Force Palm. Don't Force Palm the... Oh my god, I'm taking out the Graveler this turn. Okay, so we took out the Graveler, and now Steelix just needs to attack the Lucario. Just needs to attack the Lucario. Emily's leveling up. Rock Polish. That's all good. So you have to talk to him? No, you, you don't have to talk to him. No, you don't. No, you don't. Lucky Chan protect from crits. Maybe we'll just Psychic 
and hope for the best. Lucario force palmed. Okay, that's gonna do a very small amount of damage. Rock polished again. It's a steel type. What's it gonna do? Imagine being steel and polishing some rocks. Okay. Wow, that does not vary much at all. Uh, I'm gonna heal Emily. Do we have any status healers? Do we have- we do not have any stat- okay. Emily, you just gotta survive. Just live, Emily. Dragon Breath, that's a special move. Steelix is an idiot. Nice. Wow, that does a lot of damage. Force Bomb Paralyze, please. Please. We'll just continue to heal as we as it attacks, and let's just hope it doesn't use a physical move. Force Bomb! Yes! Lucario got a crit. What? Ralts is evolving, Emily? Wow! No. No, Emily. You can't evolve, I'm sorry. Alright, we got our team all back and fully healed thanks to Riley now that the battle is done. Ha ha ha, I'd have to agree. People training here would be... would be those with too much time on their hands. I don't think he healed me, guys. Yeah, we got a Shedinja, though. You see that? Wait a minute. We got our pretzel. Let's shift in our pretzel. There's no way they have special, super effective moves, right? They don't have super effective moves against my pretzel. Maybe they do. Okay, all they used were super effective moves. That's chill. We got at sign a Meg Mortar. Meg Mortar's gonna know some like busted moves, like Fire Punch. That's insane. Why did you use Metal Claw on the Pokemon? It's not super effective against Riley. You're a dummy, dude. What's he doing? Gotta do a lot, right? Fire Punch, that's some damage. That was a crit. Okay. Um. Okay, that rollout did way too much. That did way too much damage. Uh, we're gonna send in Ash to try and take out the Graveler, I guess? I Mega Drain the Graveler. Metal Claw, what are you Metal Clawing? The Golbat, I guess it can attack me now. Attack up, okay, I think Lucario will be able to carry. Please outspeed Ash. You can outspeed a Graveler. You're, you're a quick little gecko thing, lizard. Ooh. Oh, Ash. Coming in clutch again. No problem. Easy. Easy. Graveler's burned anyways. I was a little afraid. Double battle time. Let's do it. Is that a ho-oh? Yo, that's a ho-oh. And wait. Isn't this supposed to be a double battle? What happened to the double part of the double battle? We have Gust as a ho-oh. Alright. Well, this is fine, I guess. You went to the wrong tile? It's not my fault. I'm fine with single battles. Turn up gates of EXP. About to send in an Onyx. Sure, we'll switch. Do we have any water types? We do. How not? Yeah, did Zoe even change? I don't even know. 
You stepped wrong. Pfft. No, I didn't. Bubble beam. Perfect. Rock tomb. It misses. Doesn't even want to hit me. It's a crit. We got the type matchups. We're all good. Ash with the level up. How can bubbles hurt you? I don't know. I'm not going to question it. Golbat, switch Pokemon. Sure, we got some for a Golbat, right? At sign. Ice type. Beautiful. I can't throw out. Thanks for the two, four. And Alma Joy, thank you for the gift sub. And the real JP. How did I miss your 20 months? And Shannon with the 23. Yo, what's up, Shannon? Yo. Hope you're doing well. Confuse Ray? It's nothing. It's nothing. See? Icy Wind. I know Icy Wind doesn't do that much damage, but like, look at this. Look at this. Yeah. Yeah. We're just that good. Yeah, and Zedal, thanks for the Prime. And plus, we outspeed now. And we don't get hit in confusion. It, it's just that good. My team is just that good. Are you almost at the third gym? Uh, we could go fight the sixth gym right now. Woo, crazy delicious sugar. What are you talking about? Wait, do we do this? Oh, that would have initiated a double battle. I see. Alright, on to the next. Graveler. Turnip. Gladius. Water. Oh, that's water sport. I was like, water spout? That's incredible. No. No, that kind of sucks. Uh, you only know takedown. Honestly, I think Dragon Breath is our best play here. Need a double battle? No, 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 no. We don't need no double battles. That does a lot of damage. That does even more. Ah, uh, Turnip didn't even survive. Okay. Ash, you've got this. Let's give them a taste of their own medicine, huh? Let's give them a taste of their own medicine. Self-destruct. How does it feel, Machoke? How does it feel? It doesn't feel good. You're just, you're just stuck. You just take the hit, and you don't even survive. Is this a Nuzlocke? Yeah, totally. That's why I use self-destruct first turn. Okay, 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 okay. We're exploring. Ultra Ball. All right, no running from wild battles. What's up? I see a bunch of people saying it's their first stream. Welcome to the stream. Um, so we have nasty plot, but we don't have any special moves. Yeah, okay. Um, but we have a Mewtwo. I love Mewtwo's cry, it's so good. Anti-G, thanks for the seven. Shouldn't be a problem. Bone Rush. It's gonna do some damage. Awesome Lego. Thank you for the ten subs. I appreciate the support. Oh my god. Magnitude 7? That's gonna do nothing. Emily's a monster. Emily is always legendary. Is that just me? Also, it has the same face as Lucario. It seems like Emily is... Oh my god. Emily, what is your moveset? Emily's just always legendary. 
Yeah, they're making the same pose. Did they just, like, take the Mewtwo pose and just be like, just give it to Lucario? They're basically the same Pokemon anyways. Profitable! That's the five, dude! We have a Mewtwo at home. <laughs> Alright, the Mewtwo at home took out the Graveler. And Emily will take out the Golbat? Maybe? Luke, which, who did that hit? I don't, that's in the center. Emily, okay. <laughs> I don't know who that's supposed to be hitting. And he used Force Bomb. It's a crit! Okay, well, as long as it's a crit, that's no big deal. Except that's quad resisted. What are you doing, Lucario? Okay, quick attack, does some damage. Swift should finish it off. Not quite. All right. Not quite. All right, it's all up to you now, Emily. You can do it. Snapped out of confusion, Swift. Come on. Excellent. Took it out. Easy wild battle. Why are you playing Diamond Platinum's much better? It's actually the... So, to modify these games, you, you have to understand what the code of the game is or whatever. And that hasn't been mapped out for Platinum yet or something like that. But it has been started to get mapped out for Pokemon Diamond and Pearl. So I won't be able to do this in Pokemon Black and White. Like, I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure at sign had to just look like go into and like test stuff in the game like you had to go like change I would guess and it's I don't know I know at sign put a ton of work into this but they had to like change something and see what changed in like the game's code or whatever like hex editing yeah and you had to just see what happened or something like that Not sure if AdSide is here that could confirm that. <sighs> A lot of it was still unmapped assembly. Yeah, literally, like, AdSign had to look through unmapped assembly code to try and figure it out. Like... Like, I'm just gonna try and get an example of what unmapped assembly code looks like. I'll just, I'll, it's just, I guess, just assembly code example. Let's see. It's just like... Uh... It's basically just a bunch of nonsense. You should, yeah, if you want to send me a file, I'll show it off to stream for sure. If AdSign, if you want to send me a file, I'll show it on stream of what literally AdSign had to look through to get this to work. It's like the level above ones and zeros, basically. <laughs> Kyle Sweeney, thanks for the Prime. Appreciate the support. Not even machine code. Okay, are you paying him to do that? Oh yeah, every every single one. I'm like, that's fine. How much do I pay you for this? <laughs> Any mod that you see on my stream that was created specifically for the stream, I, like, the first thing I do is how much do you want, like, how, how much is fair to pay you for this? Alright. Okay, turn up, EXP. 
But yeah, this is good for leveling up just because you instantly get full health. Okay, okay. I have the, I have the image. Uh, basically, this was the file that at sign had to edit. This, this is what at sign had to change. At sign looked through this, literally figured out what stuff did, and changed it so the team was randomized. Like, it's insane. And it just, it just keeps going. Like, we're on line 2,000 right now, and I'm, like, halfway down. Like... It just keeps going. Anyways, at sign literally had to look through that and just figure out what it meant. Like, at sign's incredible. <laughs> oh my god. Tim was Tim. Thank you for the 10 tier 3 subs. Dude, thank you so much. I guess I, do we reach the sub goal? We did. Okay, you know what we gotta do then. And what is assembly? It's just like uh, the, the basic level of coding. <sighs> I'm gonna have to flex for you guys. You ready? <sighs> how, how do, okay, I, it looks like I wink in it as well. All right, I got my I got my shirt all rolled up. Ready? How's that? Good. <laughs> Blue fire. Thanks for the five. Perfect. Thank you. Strong ant. Awful muscle? Yeah, it's bad. I... I don't know. What are you joining to? We reached the sub goal in the top right over there. I had to flex. Uh... Psy wave the onyx? Stonks. Got, got the, the big muscle. Alright, um... I guess we need a new sub goal then, huh? What, what's the next one? Wait, wait, I, I have one, I have one. I have one. I have a good one. It'll update, it'll update. Do do buy a wizard hat? I really should, yeah. I don't I could. Turn up, you can take the hit. Turn up took the hit. Easy. Does that sign have a YouTube? I don't believe he does, no. Please, 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 if you message me a reminder, I'll probably remember. Sub goal isn't showing? Yeah, it is. It's in the top right. What's small stonks? It's it's right there. It's small stonks. Is this like the emerald version of the Gen 2 version? Aren't they the same? Weren't they the same? This randomizes af uh, after battles. Time to get up to 194 subs to know what this is. <laughs> Please, no. Um, Green Barrel, thanks to the two, and Paris, and Blizzard Boy, thanks to the subs. There's too many, there's too many subs. Tanner, you got Whooper? Wait, what? What did I do? I got Whooper. Oh, on my team, I got a Whooper. Yo! Where is Whooper? I don't know where he went. Wait, wait, where'd he go? 
He's usually right beside here. Is he on my desk? I don't know where he went. Oh, right, my mom had to borrow him to take a picture for Twitter. <laughs> it's fine. Mud bomb Geo dude. No, no, I'm small and mom is just borrowing him. Blizzard boy, thanks for the sub. Appreciate it. Yo, okay, Onyx was taken out by Lucario. Now turn up the whoopee boy. We'll take out the Geo dude, right? Right? Turnips damp and knew what was coming. The Geodude tried to explode and then Whooper said no. Oh wait, there's a full team against us. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna let him try and self-destruct again, honestly. And I'm just gonna mud bomb the Steelix. It'll be great. Force bomb does nothing because Steelix's defense are off the charts. Celix, you sandstorm does nothing for against my whoopee boy. It's all good. No problem whatsoever. No problem at all. Damp prevents the self-destruct again. Turnips mud bomb missed. No big deal. Not a problem at all. Sandstorm doesn't affect anybody on the field. Look at that. No, Lucario, we were leaving him alive because he's just wasting his turns. Man. Steal like you slam, it does nothing. My whoopee boy can take it. Look at that. Or whoopee girl, sorry. My whoopee girl can take it. Graveler? It's gonna try and explode again. Not a problem at all. Not a problem at all. Whoopee boy's gonna mud bomb. Lucario's gonna force palm. You know the moves are going to be strong when they rhyme. Have you ever thought about doing Europe-friendly streams? Uh, every stream is Europe-friendly if you uh, stay up all night. Okay. Mud bomb graveler is just gonna continue to try to explode. I mean, this is good to like fall asleep to, I would say, because it starts like 10, 9 p.m. ish. It's a good time. Shinagami, thanks for the tier one. Turn up level 31. Like to see that. All right. Mud bomb, no target, no problem. Onyx, more like <laughs> Gonyx. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Oh. He survived. No, Lucario missed. You Sandstorm. More like Gonix. There we go. <laughs> when did you get so funny? I'm still not funny, Shannon. It's just the way it is. Just the way it is. There we go. Played you like an amateur? It's because you are an amateur. If only you were better. Yo, what? Turnip does- Whoopers don't evolve. What is that? Whoopers don't evolve. Ultimate consumer, thanks to the Prime. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see what else we got for battles around here. Lucario, Turnip- What does Turnip got? Poison type. Crunch. Eh, it's probably not a good team. Let's use our legendary, uh, Emily- I haven't used... Wow. Yeah, we, we should really use Pretzel a little more, shouldn't we? It's probably a bug in the randomizer. It's probably like a glitch that Whooper was evolving. I'm not sure what that was about. Okay. Okay. Sorry, I was just speeding through that. Wait, you only know Ice Fang? You're a Water Dark type, and you don't know Water... Oh, my lord. Okay. What the heck? It should take out the, the Graveler before he attacks me, right? As long as Lucario uses his Force Palm on him. Or we get the Freeze? Okay. 
add the time. All right. Wait, my add button isn't here. Do you need me to? One second. There we go. Did it. Did the ad break. Okay, Ice Fang the Onyx, and we should have a victory here. Did someone pay for it? Looks like it. You've never seen a chat ask for ads? Okay. I, I, I talked about this before, but it's really funny. It's really funny. Do you know how... Um... Do you know how stream... Like, when Twitch was like, we're gonna auto-play ads... On your streams... And everyone just freaked out? Yu-Gi-Oh! Thanks for the four months. I guess you guys can't hear this. Because you're watching an ad. I'll wait a moment. <laughs> What's the next of it? Next video was Pokemon. The part two of the super effective moves only. Follow my faith, thanks to the Prime. Appreciate the support. Okay, okay, so... Do you know how a while back... You, uh, Twitch was like, we're gonna test for a few days. We're gonna auto-play mid-roll ads. And everyone just freaked out. Like, uh, Twitter was just ridiculously upset. At least I saw that, where they were like, we're gonna auto-play ads, and everyone was just screaming about it. It's like, this is terrible. No, was, I'm gonna miss this part of the stream now. This is, this is terrible. I hate this. All the, like, streamers were like, no, this is a terrible thing. This is a, a an absolutely bad thing. Th the thing is, it really isn't. It's actually a really good thing. Because here's, here's what's gonna happen. Every time you join a stream, a pre-roll ad plays. When you join the stream, you get the ad, right? I would say, at least for me, and I know for a lot of you people, whenever you go to search for a new stream, if you get that ad, in the 30 seconds that you're watching that ad, you just leave. You just get out, right? It's like, uh, maybe I don't feel like waiting for the ad to watch the stream. I'm just gonna leave. But if you play mid-roll ads, you don't get that pre-roll ad anymore. So it makes it so more people are gonna watch your stream and find your stream. Like, so many people cl complain about like, ah, no one's watching my stream, no one knew it's coming to the stream. It's because you have pre-roll ads on, that's a really big factor. There's still pre-roll ads? No, right now, because I played that ad for the next 20 minutes, no pre-roll ads. Anyone can come to the stream, they won't get an ad. There's nothing stopping them doing pre-roll and mid-roll ads? Well, they're gonna have to play more ads at some point. But basically, mid-roll ads are a good thing. Like, if, if, cause here's the thing. The, Twitch has to make money or else it's gonna be, it's gonna be done, right? It's not making money right now. So like, you're gonna have to play ads one way or another so the website can stay up. Or they find some other way to monetize, but ads are the easiest way. And if, Twitch auto plays mid roll ads. Basically, Twitch is like either you're gonna choose where to place your mid roll ads or we're gonna place them for you. It is kind of like a heavy handed way to do it, but it's a heavy handed way to force you to make your stream almost better for new people. Right? Like, you. If and. Because, basically, it forces you to pick where the ads are. People didn't like it because Twitch was the one playing it. Well, if you play your ads, then Twitch won't autoplay it. But it essentially makes it so... It, it you know, f makes streamers get rid of the pre-roll ads one way or another, which helps discoverability in your own stream. 
and it solves the problem of Twitch Twitch doing it. I know it's, it's probably a bit of a hot take, but after thinking about it a little bit, I would say Twitch didn't, I would say at, at best, Twitch didn't market their idea properly. Basically, they should have communicated that pre-roll ads will be off and like given like a statistic, like maybe 50% of people that go to a stream that see a pre-roll ad leave. So with us playing mid-roll ads, you will get 50% more traffic to your channel. If they marketed it like that, people would be all for it, I bet. And you can still choose to play the mid-roll ads wherever you want, but they're gonna play one way or another. Like, just say, hey, 15% more people are gonna stop by your stream. And I don't know if that's the, the, the number. But I imagine it's it's probably like up more than 20%. Skeezy, thanks for the 10. Never mind, not the 10, the nut button. The 10,000 points for the nut button. But yeah, like, here's the thing, and, and like, and you can choose when to play your ads. That's a great part. Rock Blast. Sorry, Trap Inch, you're gone. <clears throat> For a streamer, how often do you need to play an ad to evade a pre-roll ad? It depends on the length of it, but every 30 minutes. Which, compared to traditional media, is... normal. It's way better, honestly. It's like 60 seconds. Or 90 seconds. For 30 minutes? Usually TV is like 50-50. Or like... T like... One-third. Switch to pretzel? Alright. Like, TV, traditional TV is like a third ads. Do you make money from the ads? Yeah, I do. I do still get paid from the ads. Granted, it, the, the rates compared to YouTube are horrendous. But I still do, yeah. TV is like 7 to 8 minutes ads per 30 minutes? Exactly. Um, I don't know. Thanks for the prime. Lickle. Cool. Your pog. Thank you for the 21 months. That's crazy. Cal, thanks to the tier one as well. Whoa. Whoa. Hey, what's up, Hayden? All right, Golbat fainted. Emily can take that hit, right? Emily's strong. Yeah. Yeah. Emily's strong. Strong enough. I'm glad you like him, Hayden. I recognize that I- Pokemon, right? Hayden? P I mean, you're watching a Pokemon stream. I- I rec I feel like I've watched your videos in the past. Let me see. Hayden. No, not Hatsune. Hayden. No, not Dayden. Hayden. Sorry for putting the spotlight on you. I'm just checking. Okay, yeah, yeah, I've definitely watched your videos before. It was- it, it was like years ago. When it was like Wi-Fi battles. But I definitely watched them. Okay, cool. Apparently when you try and type a Hayden into your keyboard, it auto-corrects the Hatsune. Which is interesting. Yo, wait, 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 you need to switch my team around? Uh, I need to train up Pretz a little bit and Zoe. I think I'd enjoy it if streamers got sponsored did their own sponsor ads with ad breaks, like you'd never really leave the stream. That's true, yeah, they could put their own flair to it. Perfect Black, thanks for the two. Fell asleep yesterday, did I beat Link this time? Not quite. We got close. Twitch rates are even more horrendous than YouTube? Uh, yeah. Her YouTube rates aren't that bad. They don't, I mean, they don't feel that bad, at least. The da, 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 da. oh Emily, so good. But yeah, I guess that's the idea of Twitch bounties. With Twitch bounties, you can choose. Hatsune Miku was awesome, though. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know much about Hatsune. Didn't Hatsune Miku make that one game? 
Uh, I didn't have time to counter yet. Uh... Minecraft? Oh yeah, Minecraft or something. That sounds right. Oh, right, it's I had to name me wrote Harry Potter. I forgot. That's what it is. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, looks like Emily can't take the hit. I'm just gonna destiny bond because I think that'll be funny. Are you familiar with the free melee controversy? Absolutely, I am. I donated a thousand dollars to Ludwig's uh, tournament, potentially making to, to try and help out, make it one of the biggest melee tournaments of all time, because the the proceeds for that are going to charity. Okay, Zoe can take this out. Name is Emily, so every time I say Emily, I look up because you hear the name. Sorry, you're gonna hear that a lot today. Razor Leaf, that. And this should be an easy win. Yeah. Tell us a good story. A good story. I feel like I need to go outside more to start getting stories to give you guys, because I can never come up with stories, because I never leave the house anymore. Huh. Aurora Beam, that'll do good for Graveler. I'm trying to think. What's the weather like today? I don't know. Any weird job stories? Any weird job stories? Um... Let me think. Um... Uh, do you know Mars? I've, I've interacted with Mars occasionally, yeah? I don't know them very well, but... Yes? Hmm. Can you tell us about the sawmill you worked at first interview? I've actually only been interviewed for a job once. I mean, I got the job. The whole sawmill job is a weird story in your current job too, yeah? Hmm. Okay, let me, let me think. There's probably something to do with the sawmill. Um... Let me think. Let me think. Fluorescent, thanks to the Prime. Raving, thanks to the Prime. Did you get a new car yet? No, I'm working on it. I am going to call tomorrow morning to get it towed. So they can look at it and fix it. Next sub goal should be a story stream? That was just shiny only. Please have a water type move that's better than water gun. Never mind. Onyx, take it out. Do you live in California? I live in Canada. Um, I mean, here's the thing. When I was in in high school, there was a sawmill hiring for a weekend cleanup position for students, and I was like, sure. Yeah, that sounds good to me. Especially because. The rate that they paid you was, I think, a little over... I think it was $27 an hour. And I was like, yeah, that sounds good to me. So... Um... I, I went there, and my previous experience was I worked as a, uh... I worked with a company that did, like, some construction, kind of. Uh, and... I ended up, uh... So I had some, like, physical labor experience in the past. And I, I, I did, I did, uh, did my best. 
And... So I went... And I applied, and... I mean, the interview was pretty simple. They asked, like, what I was doing in school, what I was interested in and stuff, because I'm a student, and I mean, at the time, I was... Like, I mean, literally, I had top of my class straight A's, like... Pretty basic, and I, I, could, I could pull off a pretty good interview, I think. And they had, like, previous work experience was just, like, physical labor, which I had good references as well. And so they, oh, they're like, okay. And I ended up getting hired, and, and my job essentially was to show up at midnight on Friday. Work, like, use uh, compressed air to blow down machinery, then sweep it up afterwards. Until, like, 8.30 a.m. What was crazy was, like, the, the previous job that I had... Uh, I would work from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. And I, like, there would be, like, a few minute breaks every, like, 30 minutes. There'd be, like, you'd take, like, three or four minutes, maybe five minutes every, like, 30 minutes for, like, 12 hours. So, those days were, like, super long. And I remember going to the to work, and I remember I'd, like, start working. I'd, I, I would uh, do the thing, and, like, two hours later... Or wait, would they be like 20 minutes to tell us what we're doing that day? Then we go to work, and then an hour and a half later, they'd be like, Okay, break time! It's like, what? It, already? And we'd take a break for like 15 minutes, 20 minutes usually, because it's midnight and no one cares. And then, you know, we'd, we'd go back to work for another like hour and a half. We'd have like a 45 minute lunch break. And then go back to work for like an hour and a half. We'd be like, oh, it's another break. We'd take another break, work another hour and a half, and then we're done. It was so, it felt so fast. So, like, I did that for a long time, where I just were worked on, like, the, the, the graveyard shift. I would go back, I'd sleep all Saturday, then, uh, then I'd work at 6 a.m. on Sunday and do uh, a day shift, basically. So that was interesting. But, um, yeah, sure, we'll just uproar. But... Yeah, it was it was good, and then eventually I ended up getting on to uh, two day shifts because uh, they offered. Like I ended up getting to become the charge hand of the the graveyard shift, so I was like in charge of people uh, on the graveyard shift. But eventually they were like, "Yo, you just want to do spark watch during the day because we need people to spark watch." And now, I mean, I've told you guys about the spark watch position. But basically, I would just stand there for eleven hours. And make sure nothing caught on fire, but nothing caught on fire. So I just stood there for, for 11 hours, two days a week. And, like, after eight hours, you get paid time and a half. So, like... I just worked two days a week. It was great. I, I would just stay in my head and think about stuff. I remember for, like, four weeks in a row, I just thought about, like, what was it? There was the, the P versus NP problem. I was like, I wonder... I wonder if I could think about that and figure it out. Obviously, I didn't figure it out because it's like one of the hardest problems in science currently, but I thought about it <laughs> for several weeks. And I came to the conclusion that unless you can see the future, it doesn't really seem like you can. It doesn't really seem like they're the same thing. Imagine if you solved it, though. Okay, it's the one thing that I'm kind of proud of in my head, so P, P versus NP... I can't remember what it is, but there's like, um... There's different problems in, like, computer science. There's, like, P problems that are super easy to solve. You can solve them and, like, a computer can solve them no problem. But NP problems can take, like, a really long amount of time. They're really, like, resource intensive and they take, like... They're way, way harder and way longer to, to solve. Essentially. And basically, the gist of it is that, like, all NP problems can be boiled down to a single... Like, they can be translated into every other NP problem, pretty much. I'm, I'm simplifying quite a lot here. But I remember, I was like, I wonder... I didn't understand that before I started thinking about it, but after long enough, I, I started to, like... I, after those four weeks, I was like, okay, I can figure out how to translate these problems into the other problems, but I have no idea how to solve them with, with the P or whatever. A, a good way to, yeah, a good way to describe it is P, a P problem is just checking a Sudoku solution. 
An NP problem is finding the solution. Can you get soft locked on the island? No. And they're basically the big thing in science, like computer science, is are those the same per type of problem? They stand for polynomial time versus non-polynomial time, but I mean, it's people that aren't in computer science, like if they haven't learned about that, it just mean it's a meaningless word. Just cancel out the p. N equals one. Solved. Damn, dude. Okay, um, like, I don't know what we're gonna do here. I'm just gonna continue to sucker punch, I think. Yeah, basically, um, if a solution, and here's, here's the dumb thing. Here, here is the, the, the dumb thing. I was thinking about it. It's me, Joji, thanks for the four months. I was thinking about it, it was like, if I could figure out a solution to the P versus NP problem... I'm pretty sure, like, did you guys know that encryption, like, computer encryption, is based on the idea that they're not the same? P or NP isn't the same? So if you figure out that they are the same, you could literally just go into any computer you want in the world without any anything stopping you, essentially. So I was like... Or, you could mine an absurd amount of Bitcoin in a really small amount of time. So if you could figure that out, you could just become a billionaire, and then release the results. Because you could just get all of this Bitcoin, sell it all, because you have a stupid amount, because you can mine it faster than anyone else. <laughs> and I was like... Great, sounds illegal. I mean, it might be, but Bitcoin is anonymous for the most part, right? That's what's so messed up. But obviously, you like, if someone has done that, they wouldn't tell anybody. That does, in fact, find it seem illegal? It's not illegal. Why would it be illegal? You just found a faster way to mine Bitcoin. Black Tag, thanks for the 19 months. What up? Thanks for the Prime. You'll probably be dead very soon because all the banking system is based on that. Yeah. I mean... <clears throat> yeah, it's a Millennium Prize problem. Are we going to focus on the game now? I mean, we're mostly just grinding. Emily's kind of strong, though. But I, I imagine what, what you would do is if you figured out that they were the same thing, you wouldn't reveal the solution that you come up with. You would just, like, officially announce that you came up with a solution. So then let the world change their whole, like, cryptography or whatever. And then then you reveal what ha what it is. I don't know. Yes, I did, SSG Chris, I did. Anyways, let's move on, because I'm talking about stuff that I don't understand fully. Grind to level 35? We can. Yo, this battle is kind of hard, though. Uh, we're going to Leech Seed the Haunter. Never mind. Oh my god. Are we even able to win this battle? Rock slide, let's hope that takes him out. They used roost, rock slide. That does nothing, okay. Uh, we're gonna screech because then Lucario will be able to do more. Don't take me out in one hit, not one hit, not in one hit. Ever nuzlocke this game mode? That wouldn't be fun. Nuzlocking this game mode would just mean... You would just grind. It just requires so much grinding. Do you like math? Yeah. Yeah, when I go back to university, it'll be for math. My webcam isn't touching the bottom of my screen. Yes, it is.
Those are just the borders. What were you studying before? Math and computer science. But I just go back from math. Is there a whiteout counter? Yeah, four. When do you plan to go back? Uh, I am going back to university once I am... Once I've moved. Which I was planning on moving this year, but now because of COVID, probably not. Um, I mean, there's only 20 days left in the year, so no. Um... Math major sucks, I know, since I'm a math major. The one reason why I think I'll enjoy a math degree is because I did one math class that got into proofs when I was in university. I only did, like, two years. And that was the class that I would have... that I was basically the most interested in. And so I, I would like to, to go back for that. Because it's just like problem solving. It's great. What kind of proofs class? Uh, it was the fundamentals of mathematics or something. It was like a. It got into like math theory. Like I remember that, like 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 proving one plus one kind of thing. Maths will include a lot of professors. A lot of proofs and basically no applications, just so you know that's aware that you're aware. I'm not sure what you mean by no applications. Honestly, here's here's the thing. I don't need to go to univ like basically I don't need to go to school anymore. I don't have to. Like with with Twitch and YouTube, if it keeps going for like a little bit more time. Like, I'm pretty much set. Like, I could- I could do this for the rest of my life, for the most part. So I'd just be going to school for some stuff that I'm interested in learning about. And I just like learning. It's not a backup plan. I'd just be going because it's- I- something I want to learn about, and... School is really, really good, really fun. If there's no pressure, and it's stuff you're interested in. Right? You're not- I'm not being forced to go to school to have a career. You would be going just because you want to. And you, you like, you, you won't be like- you won't dread school anymore. Because, like, I would say, like, almost all of people that hate school is because, one, they're, like, forced into it. They, they feel they have to do it. There's certain things that they just don't care about that they want to- that they're forced to learn about. Like, I would say that's probably like it, right? You- you either don't want to- you're not interested in the topic, you feel like you're forced into it, and... It- like... That's it. That's so Canadian. American college is so expensive? Yeah. Kirby Crab, thanks for the prime. That was me! I got a degree in something I don't care about. Fair. Elixir, thanks for the five months. What happened? I looked away and Ash was dead. Huh? Alright. Turnip! American College is like 50k a year. <laughs> it's a 50k a year streaming service. Yeah, that's pretty ridiculous. That is a little absurd. Are you sponsored by BenQ? I mean, Zowie, which is a uh, 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 extension from BenQ. I actually have a BenQ monitor, yeah. Not, not the the monitor wasn't sponsored though. I, I bought that before I got the the Panda sponsorship. Ghost Smurf, thanks to the tier one. Oh god, this Meta Cham might take me out. Laquitas. I just want to add that this is not non-polynomial. It's not a deterministic polynomial. We do not know if it's non-polynomial. That is a big question. We cannot prove non-deterministic means we kind of guess the solution and then verify it. Pretty so, pretty pretty much right. Cap Pog, nice eight. About to graduate, so you'll have to watch me again. Let's go. It's gonna take me out in a single hit. High jump kick. Yep. There it is. My Canadian college is top three in Canada. It's three thousand per semester. That sounds about right. Yeah. I hope we can survive against this Metacham. 
Did you just randomly join into an, a P versus MP discussion? Kind of, but it's kind of... Oh wait, we can just protect as it high jump kicks and it's gonna take itself out. This is hilarious. Oh no, it used Calm Mind. Ah, it read me like a damn book, dude. Now it's gonna high jump kick? Oh my god. But it missed! <sighs> Outplayed. Alright, now we protect as it tries to high jump kick again. It, it just, it knows what... Do I double protect? No, we bite. No, don't take me out in one hit. Let's go. Okay. The hard reads, dude. It's insane. But we'll protect again. It's gonna high jump kick. Come on. Don't calm mind. This this is ridiculous if it does it again. It knows faint. This is the first time I've ever seen that move used properly. Like, the first time I have ever seen that move used properly at all. Dude, what? Oh my god, it's a crit! That's probably the only Pokemon that can take a hit. Do we have any priority moves? I don't think our Pretzel can take a hit. Do you have... Yeah, uh, Peck? Sure. Just survive one hit. Survive a Force Palm. Come on, Pretzel. Just one force palm. Damn it. Why is game sound only in the left ear? Because your headphones aren't plugged in properly. <laughs> uh, we're not surviving that. Damn it. Man, this Iron Island is destroying me. How do you get unbanned from the Discord? I'm sorry, but you just don't get unbanned from the Discord. If you get banned from the Discord, I... Wow. Honestly, wow. It is so lenient. <laughs> Wait, you have a Discord? Yeah, I do. I never understood blacking out after your, oh, your Pokemon fainted. It does it. The I guess their trainer attacks you. Once all the Pokemon are down, you're the next person. How do you get banned from the Discord? You are. You act like a. I mean, it, you got to be pretty terrible. It's it's pretty lenient. So that Metacham took me out, which is uh, it sucks. Okay, I'm just trying to train my weak Pokemon. Could you, like, give me a chance, Graveler? Bubble Beam? That should do it, right? Haven't played this version, why do you have to do Iron Island? I don't have to do Iron Island, I just want to. Jibs, thanks for the gift sub. Chivo, thanks for the two. BC, Seth, Faye, thanks for the three months. Why not catch level 30? I don't have a bond with those level 30s. Wait, did it? Did it randomize into another po Polyrath? What are the odds? Huh. Okay. Randomize it still works. It just happened to randomize into the same Pokemon. Huh. If we wait again wait out again, we can get the EXP share in a turn, that's true, yeah. Yo, heal my Pokemon. Okay, we need revenge. We 100% need revenge. I'm going to get revenge. Prepare to be destroyed. Oh, God. Wait a Zapdos. Okay, Zapdos can really do almost nothing to these Pokemon, so we will be switching to our... Oh, God. 
I cannot talk in the Discord. Why? All right, Frey. All right, let, let's look at the Discord really quick together. And we'll figure it out. We will figure it out. Let, let's take a look. Let's take a look at the Discord together. Um, is there a view Discord as setting? Where is that? Members... Overview... How do you do that again? Top left? View Discord... Uh... I'm trying to see if we can view it as a certain role. Server insights, server settings... I'm trying to see. This is taking too long. Members, maybe? Overview? I'm pretty sure there was a thing for this, right? Server settings, roles? It's in roles, okay. View server as role. Ah, there we go. View server as... Sure. So, when you get into the Discord, you s oh wait, you guys can't see this. Um, is there anything that you can't see here? No, this is fine, okay. That's not the right layout. There we go, okay, okay, where am I? Where am I, here we go. Okay, when you get into the Discord, you see this. You see rules and info and ant hole. Hi there, this is my Discord server. Blah, 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 blah. There's a bunch of rules. Ant hole. Welcome to the ant hill. To see the rest of the server, go read rules and info. Oh, let's read it. Okay. No mini modding, no weird stuff, no hate speech, etc., etc. You read through it. Be respectful of others. Use each channel for its use. English only. Randomizes or pin messages and promotions channel. That is a rule because so many people asked. If you're stuck in ant hole, Type dollar sign ant to see the rest of the server. Wow, it's amazing how that works. If you read the rules, you can type in the chat, just like Galaxy Reven. Wait for it. Yo, and now they can see the rest of the server. Anyways, let's go back. Who would have thought? Um, we're gonna ice shard the graveler. Reading. As a customer service rep, I felt that. Yeah. Vanquish them. Thanks for the four. But now you know how. Thamlin, thanks for the six months. And I idolize you. That's dangerous. Don't do that. BMN Divinity, thanks for the Prime. What badge are we on? We're going to the sixth badge, but I need to level up a little bit. Just a little bit. How is it dangerous? If you idolize a person and see them as perfect, right? They're, then, like, the, the first time they make a mistake, you'll feel betrayed. And I'm not perfect, no one's perfect. It's not a good thing. Some prime whistling? Did I whistle? I didn't even notice. But you kind of are? No, I'm not. I, I I didn't put my dishes away from supper last night. There's a plate on the floor. It's gross. I mean, the plate's empty. I ate all my food, but I didn't put the dishes away. Spilled out thanks to the two months. The word supper is gross? No. 
On the floor? I don't have enough room on my desk. It is gross. It's actually gross. There you go. Chunky Runky's just looking at it. I keep Chunky Runky in a pink croc. That's not- I mean, that's perfect, honestly. He looks so cozy in the pink croc. Let me show you. Just give, just give me a sec. Like, honestly, though. Does he not look so cozy? <laughs> what is that thing? He's my son! Aww. Let's put it in sport mode. Here we go. He's so cozy. It's, it's his bed. It's his bed. He just, he sleeps here. Okay. Wait, two rungs? Yeah, that's the plush one that I sold. That was for sale for a while. Uh... Oh, we're back here, huh? We're gonna iron defense. Alright. We're back at this dang old Metacham, and I will destroy it with a Clamp Earl that's level 24. Just saying it now. Just saying it now. If that's your son, the mother must be messed up. There's no mother. Ren Everdeen, thanks for the 14 months. Your mom deserves better than to hear you still leave plates on the floor in your bedroom you're 24. I just forgot about it. I forget about a lot of things. I forget to make my bed some days. I forget to do my laundry some days. I forget to put away a plate some days. This isn't all on the same day. Well, today it's the same day, but not every time it's the same day. <clears throat> I forgot to fix my car as well, yes. Okay, so this Metacham is going to high jump kick, but I am iron defensing to try and survive a high jump kicks. Just like this. Have I forgot to get new glasses for the past two years? Well, yes. But, whatever. It happens. We have an ad redeemer? Alright. Ad break? Um... The... The, uh, the... So I told you the next Pokemon video is the Super Effective Moves Only is coming out. Friday or Saturday? But Monday. Super Mario Odyssey. But the floor is lava is coming out. And I believe the creator of the mod also is releasing it publicly that day too. Which is pretty cool. Uh, I guess we could clamp and whirlpool. That would deal some damage. High jump kick, how much is that doing? That is doing still a lot of damage. And my attack missed. I used iron defense, oh, only twice. Okay. We are out of everything, we only have milk. Does it mean SMO floor is poison coming soon too? Yes, I think Crafty Boss is almost finished up with it. It has some visual issues. Metacham missed, Pog, dude. Okay. Iron defense, works away. Yeah, and by the way, I probably won't be getting glasses until February because there's no eye appointments. So I can't get new glasses because I haven't gotten an eye appointment in like a year and a half, two years. Pokemon Emerald, but the wall is lava. It just might work. Is that a shiny? Not that I know of. Okay, hit a clamp. Faint. Pfft, I don't have protect on this thing. We clamp down. Okay. So we clamped it. It'll deal some clamp damage. Boom. Metacham's hurt by clamp. Next, we whirlpool it. Get the whirlpool damage. Force palm, paralyze, yikes. And we miss whirlpool. I hate these moves, dude. Come on. Captain Ninja Guy, thanks for the five. 
We survived that. No big deal. Whirlpool. It hits. It does like one HP, but now Clamp deals damage. Wait, Whirlpool did... Did Whirlpool... Did Whirlpool not deal damage at the end of the turn? Can you not Clamp and Whirlpool at the same time? You can't like Clamp and then Whirlpool and then Fire Spin just so there's like a ring of death around this? Oh, that sucks. How much longer do the stream ends? I would say 20 more minutes or so. Okay. All right, jump kick does nothing. And we clamp again. Clamped it. We're good. That should take it out next turn. All we gotta do is uh, survive one more hit. We can take it. No crit. Pretzel gets revenge. Oh, faint. I didn't even need to heal. Holy shit. You have a good one. Easy. Easy. Level 25. Pretzel leveled up. Well, you know how... Did they just say you have no idea how frustrating it is to lose? No, I have no idea. No idea. Is Pretzel shiny again? Pretzel is never shiny. All right, Emily, see you around. <sighs> okay, we have an Abra. I'm gone, dude. We're out. See ya. Lucario, and then we should outspeed. Abras are pretty quick. Let's go! Never mind. Apparently the Onyx is faster. Please get out of here, Pretzel. It failed. I guess it doesn't work in double battles. I guess it's... I guess it doesn't work in double battles. Okay, Pretzel, that's what you get. You deserve it. Isn't teleport minus priority? I don't know. But I do know we have two legendaries on our team, one of which is Ash. Ash will take out the Graveler before it magnitudes again. I feel it. We're gonna use, uh. Oh my god. Um, Fire Fang on Graveler, I guess. <laughs> and yeah, teleport isn't minus priority. Heatran is a mythical Pokemon. It's it's same thing. Same thing. Legendary, mythical, they're the same thing. Ash. Level it up. Burn? No burn, okay. Um what does this do? I can never I can, is that physical defense? I don't know. Yeah, Heatran is a legendary and not a mythical, right? I'm pretty sure mythical Pokemon are like event Pokemon. This is just a legendary, it's not an event. Clockman thanks the prime. Wiki literally says legendary? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Burn, take it out. No, come on. Oh, thanks for the quick attack, Lucario. Appreciate that. Mythical Pokemon are event mons plus Deoxys. Deoxys is an event mon, is it not? Is there any way to get Deoxys without an event? Oh, I guess Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire, right. Item? Hey, Iron Plate. Look at that. There's text written on it. When the universe was created, shards became this plate. Whatever. Deoxys is not in the story in Oras? I'm fairly sure it is. Right? Pretty sure it is. Yo, 
Sorry, I'm getting distracted. I just want to check lowest percent. Also, I didn't expect my most recent- Oh my god. I didn't expect my most recent video to do so well. Uh, we'll fake out at the very least. Yeah, the Delta episode. Like, it's appealing- it's like- it's my best performing videos out of the last 10, which is crazy. Like, what? How's it doing? How does the XP gain work as normal? It's nuts, dude. Please check Twitter. I tuned you to something. I'll check it out, out after stream. Death. I think you did this last stream, and it was a dry. I'll check it out. Uh, we will use nature power. It's gonna become a ro wait. Nature power doesn't do. Whoops! I accidentally nut. Did you guys hear that? My bad. Pretzel, nature power turn into rock slide. Use rock slide. Okay. It's weird that you can't target a specific Pokemon with nature power. That does almost no damage. I get. I mean, I guess I am level 25, so that makes sense. Ugh. Thanks, mom. We'll just switch into a water or grass type. According to Pokemon lore, mythicals are those legendaries that should exist only one of. Like Mew or Celebre, for example, and you need real life actions to get them. Well, there you go. So, I guess Shaman and Darkrai are not mythical Pokemon. Right? No, no, no. The Shaman and Darkrai are not mythical. They're legendaries. You had to go through that weird side quest where you, like, where you, like, bike in that specific spot and then you go into this dark mystery zone and you, like, go through this invisible maze for, like, 45 minutes and you, like, save the game, turn it off. It's, it's really similar to the Reggies, right? But, I mean, there's less hints. And then, you know, you save the game, turn it off, turn it back on, and there, you're there right in front of you. It's it's just like a... You, you can get, um... Shaman and Darkrai, similar to the Reggies. What are you guys talking about? Well, Magnitude. No, 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 they're not... They're no. Yeah, also, Mew isn't, um... Mew isn't mythical, either. Uh, Mew is legendary, you just, you go to that one trainer and like, it's similar to the Reggies. You go in front of a one trainer, you fly, you go and you like, defeat this one slow poke, and then you walk onto a bridge and it just appears. Right? That's, that's the only way to get a Mew. It's all in-game stuff, Mew is legendary. Before Gen 6, there was no delimination between them. Hm. I don't know if you're joking or not right now. What, you guys... No, you can get a Mew. There's that side quest. Apparently the whole thing is down. Yo... You guys know about the, um, the, the Mew under the truck thing? Do you guys know about that? Where there's like, Mew is under the truck in, in that, that truck? Did you know that Someone essentially created a, a virus in in one of in the Pokemon where if you trade with a game that is infected with the virus, it will put Mew under the truck.
and that's all it does. I'll, I'll show you it. I'll show you. It's so cool. They basically, like, made it, it whenever it, it connects to another game, it injects, like, code. Yeah, yeah, here it is, here it is. Uh... Just ignore the, the audio. We'll just mute the audio. But yeah, this is made by, um... Mr. Cheese. They're crazy. I've liked it. I've watched it, like, several times. But, basically, they made a virus from, like, a hacked game. But basically, when you trade with this, it was bad. But, essentially, they fixed it so it looks like a normal game that you're trading with. After the trade... Like, it looks normal. But after you trade with a, a virus game, you can go over to here. You can use surf. You can surf around to get to the truck. And you can surf, and Mew appears. And this is a normal game but it got a virus that modified it. And I'm pretty sure whenever you beat Sabrina, I think it patches it, it fixes the virus, but yeah, level 50 Mew can appear. Pretty cool, right? So they basically made a virus to make that actually be an existing thing. Pretty cool. So if you ever trade with one of those games that have that virus, and it, it's like, it's a virus, because it actually, I mean, it does a good thing. Um, you can essentially use strength on the truck, it makes it, it allows you to do that. And then it, it like, fixes it when you get the fifth badge. So the, the virus is not there anymore. Because it's like a, an automatic thing that the game does. A check for or something. Uh, what are we doing here? Oh, right, this is the other battle we lost to. I forgot. Uh, let's take out the Ponyta first. What if you already have the fifth badge? If you have the fifth badge, it, you can't get it. It just doesn't work. You just don't get the virus. It, the game does some, like, check or reorganizes memory or something to, uh, and gets rid of the code for it. Or the place where the, cord, the code is stored or something like that. The presence of the badge causes an FF hex code or something, and it causes, like, an error? Yeah. I don't know. I you Watch the original video if you want information on it. It's really cool. Um, We'll use knockoff again. Knockoff sucks in this gen, but it's going to be better than pwn, pwn missile? Pin missile. Impossible Jump City was very wholesome. Hey, glad you liked it. How much time did you spend on second gen? I mean, I beat second gen. I don't really have anything else. Like, I, I beat it. That's pretty much it. Pwn Missile. What year is it? Yeah. If only it was good. This team is really hard to beat. These ace trainers, they're kind of good. It's crazy. You know what? Let's acupressure. Let's raise random stats, dude. Let's do it. I'm crazy. What, what are we gonna get? What are we gonna get? Acupressure? What happened? Evasiveness sharply rose? That's pretty friggin' pog. And it missed. Let's just continue to acupressure. Acupressure? Speed sharply rose. Let's go. Acupressure? Special attack rose. Special defense sharply rose. This thing is so good. Acupressure is actually kind of broke. We can acupressure our. Defense sharply rose? Okay. That's so cool. I had no idea you can use it on your partner. That's so sick. It was useless, but that's sick. Haunter, don't curse me. I'm in the middle of acupressuring. Nice. 
bite, it missed. We're getting so strong with acupressure. Special defense. Oh my god. This pretzel is becoming a monster. Are you gonna do this with another Pokemon game? I've done it with three Pokemon games already. I've done it with Gen 1, Gen 2, Gen 3, and now Gen 4, I believe, right? Have we done this in three generations? Or... No, we've done this in Gen 2 and Gen 3. Wing attack, whatever. No problem. Acupressure, go! Attack sharply, Rose? That's what I was waiting for. Wing attack. I would like a defense to sharply raise. Gen 5 next. Gen 5 is too hard. Until we've used all 30 power points. Alright, we'll go all 30. Defense sharply rose. Good. That's what we're looking for so we don't get hit by those wing attacks. Attack sharply rose. Uh oh. That's bad. We're confused. It's bad. And we're almost out of milk. Okay, I'm done. I'm going to now knock off this Haunter and hope we don't. Oh, sucker punched. That does nothing. It's not very effective. Gen 5 is too hard to modify. Knock off hits, do a lot of damage. Wow. Knock off sucks in this generation. You see how much damage that did? That's incredible, dude. We'll knock off again. Pretzel, hurt yourself. That's going to do a lot. Yeah, never mind. Knock off. Break free of confusion. Break free. Snapped out of confusion. Let's go. Uh, yeah, Shiny Centipede. Video comes out on Saturday or Friday. Alright. Now, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just a 1v1 now. So I'll heal up with Melk one more time. And I guess we will knock off once just to see how much damage it does, but we might have to pin missile. Pin missile probably will do more. Yeah. Yikes. Okay, pin missile. Yikes. We're gonna have to acupressure more. <laughs> Alright. My accuracy rose. Because it has roost. Defense. Speed. Defense. No, I need attack. There we go. I think that's all of our attack boosts we can get. This is busted. Acupressure is busted. I don't think it raises any stats. Acupressure is actually busted. It failed. All of my stats are maxed. I have max accuracy, evasion, attack, speed, defense, special defense, and speed. That is busted, dude. Let's see how much knockoff does. Like, this pretzel is good. Nothing can stop it. And it does 30 damage to a Pelipper. We're gonna have to use Leer six times. All right. One, two, three. Four. Five. Six. Okay, so now it's at minus six. What level are you training for? I'm just doing the Iron Islands. Does a good amount of damage. I'm fine with that. Keep in mind, knockoff is 20 power in this generation. Knockoff is a hot garbage. Knockoff sucks. We took it out. No problems. Pseudo Wudo. 
It's kind of wood. Okay, you know what? We're gonna leer again six times. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Let's see what Pin Missile does. It's a crit. Hit one time. Damn. A single pin missile. Like one. Killed it. Pretzel's a monster. Alright, one more fight. After this. Pretzel. Pretzel's still a monster. I believe in you, Pretzel. Um, roll out on the goal bat. You can do it. Infatuated. Excellent. That was the first time I think you could ever say you've seen Pin Missile be a one-hit KO. Self-destruct. Well, that was an easy battle. Uh, sure. Let's send an Ash. Rest. Perfect. Alright. Yo, if we can actually make it to those grunts with this team, it's gonna be so easy. Charizard, Alakazam. Come on. Responsible for agitating the Pokemon. Should be easy. Okay, blah, blah, blah. I want to get into this battle. Here we go. Press select while you're selecting move. It does nothing. I've tried it, I think. Oh no, I pressed Y. I don't have a, a, a key set for that, Arun. Buxbun, thanks for the prime. I appreciate the support. When are you continuing your only super effective moves? No, no moves do damage run? I finished it, actually. I finished that run. Um, the, It'll come out on this weekend, probably. Okay, Psybeam, Zubat. Ned Japer, no. Okay, Force Palm took out the Glam Meow. Easy. Wing Attack. Took that. Side Beam, will this be a one-hit KO? It might. One-hit KO? Okay, Pretzel Strong. Another Zubat. Krogonk. Should be pretty easy to take these out. Took out the Zubat in one hit. Will they get to attack? I wonder. Pretzel leveled up. Psybeam. Krogonk. Get taken out. Pog, dude. Easy. Golbat. And Stunky. Okay. We'll side beam the Golbat. And Lucario's gonna bone attack the Stunky. He's gonna bone the Stunky. Bone the Stunky? Never mind. You missed. Okay. That's chill. Of all the Pokemon runs you've done, which was the most, most enjoyable? These ones are the most fun. I like these ones the most. Come on. Bone the Stunky. Why did you not bone the Stunky? What are you doing? I guess that that's probably why he didn't bone the Stunky. Never mind. He just force palmed it. He was like, if Bone Rush is gonna miss, we'll just force palm. Stunky with no bone. Wolfie, thanks for the prime. And easy battle. Are you gonna finish 3D World? Oh right. I should edit that or get that edited. Yeah. Pretzel wants to learn Signal Beam. It literally does not matter. Pretzel, give up. 
You d you're gonna forget it after this battle anyways. Do you prefer your Stunky with or without the bones? Personally, I'm a boneless Stunky kind of guy. But yeah, so we had a Charizard and an Alakazam and all we used was the Porygon. I thought that was gonna be a little bit harder, honestly. Thanks, you really helped me out. I have a Pokemon egg, sure. Thank you, but you don't have room to take it. Well, guess I'm not getting it. Sparky pens, thanks for the four. And we're go okay, we're not gone yet. Uh, all right. Yo, Emily, legendary again. Mud bomb. Look at this. This is gonna be an easy KO for Emily. Emily has got this in the bag, dude. Emily can take those slams, hit those mud bombs, no problem. Look at this. Boom, easy damage. Mud bomb again. It was never an issue. No problems whatsoever. Emily's just too strong sometimes. It happens. Yeah, what's this? What's this? What is this? There's an item here? Shiny stone! We're never gonna use it! Okay! Pretzel, sure. Leaf blade it. Bye, Graveler. Why did Wooper become an emote here? Is there some reference you're missing? Um, it's the best Pokemon. All right, Pretzel, took it out. Let's go. We're gonna change the team to Panda? I am in Panda. I'm in both teams, and Colony and Panda. All right, let's go back, and we're gonna try the sixth gym now. We're gonna try the sixth gym. That took longer than expected, but I mean, I, this game is very long. Uh, I need to go to the Pokemon Center first. What program are you using for the randomized teams? It's not a program. The game has been modified. Not even the EXP share? I don't need no EXP share. I don't need an EXP share. Alright. Someone asked, hey, are you allowing yourself to switch your team? Yes, I am. Let's switch our Meganium to the second slot. Wait a minute. That's what happens. If we switch our Pokemon around, they get randomized. I forgot to say that. So we can't prep for battles. Because if we prep for battles and swap our team around, they just get re-randomized. Alright. Let's see what we can do with a Poochiana. Is a modified ROM available? Not yet, no. <clears throat> I can swap to get better Pokemon. I'm only allowing myself to swap if I need HMs. HM Pokemon. Puzz Dragon, thanks for the Prime, so you can't get soft locked. Okay, at sign. I believe in you. Swagger. Uh, at sign, buddy, I don't think you can survive that. Yep. <laughs> Yikes. Okay, um. Pretzel, maybe? You have Water Pulse, that's not bad. And you outspeed? It's not a bad amount of damage. It is, it is double edging again though, which... It's gonna do a little bit, uh... Like a little bit of damage. Throw up the Dream, thanks for the Prime. Water Pulse... Confuse? Please? Torment? Does that mean I can't use the same move twice in a row, right? Ah. Looks like we're going down. Oh, you use Screech, though, like an idiot! We can just Water Pulse. Vinicule, thanks for the Prime. Yeah, we can just Water Pulse now. Nice! Pretzel did it!
Sweet. Does Double Edge not recoil this gen? It had Rock Head. So it does not get recoil damage. Sup. Do -do 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 This team is pretty stacked. <sighs> boop, 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 boop. How's your son? He's doing well. Feeling a little green today. But what's new? Uh, we have Rock Blast, I guess. Sure. Do a lot? Oh. Well. It is what it is. Yo, wait a minute. We might actually be able to take a, take him out. Never mind. He used Iron Tail. We're gone. We're gone. Goodbye. Pretzel's done. Stomp for flinch. It outspeeds me. What if using a Fire Stone on an Eevee? Well, yeah, we could get a Fire type, but it's not going to know any Fire moves. Uh, Turnip will know Bubble Beam or Water Pulse or at least Ice Ball. Aurora Beam, I guess. Sure. Nice. Good job, Turnip. Turnip's been carrying today. Turnip's been really, really good. Pip Pipey? Pippy? Thanks for the Prime. Appreciate it, by the way. And there's another level. Okay. Mampat, thanks for the sub, dude. The gift sub. Uh, I know in Pokemon Platinum this has a Scizor. Hopefully it still has a Scizor. We'll see. Biller of Salt, thanks for the Prime. Do you still have a Scizor? Maybe? Regular old Skaroopy and then a bug type after? We'll see. Flamethrower or something? Fire Fang? That'll do. Almost. Okay. Skaroopy use Poison Sting. Don't poison. Pain. Pain! That's okay. Okay. But Scizor though. Right? This has got to be a Scizor unless they change the battle. They changed the battle. Interesting. Uh, Fire Fang is going to do almost nothing. It, it, it will do almost nothing. Like, honestly, Dragon Rage might be the play here. I'm going to see how much Fire Fang does. If it does less than 40, we'll do it again. That's less than 40. Yeah, Sandstorm. All right. Are you going to be streaming normally during Christmas time? So, I'll probably take off... Uh, the Thursday and Friday, I think. But, like, around Christmas. So I'll take two days off. Because I'll have Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Alright, Dragon Rage is easy. Now he uses a move. Okay. What's up, Kiwi Kirby? Welcome. Gonna see Aunt Mom? Yes, I'll probably go see my mom. Christmas. Wait, oh god, we might lose this battle now. Supersonic, I guess. Hope it hits itself in confusion. Bumblebee Sticker, thanks for the Prime. Yes? Okay. We got a little bit of sand. I'm gonna try and uh, stomp. Will do more because bite isn't super, isn't neutral in this gen. And we can flinch. That was a crit. Nice. So we can flinch. Excellent. It's weird because in BC they've told us not to visit family. Have they? I haven't really kept up with that. 
I mean, the thing is, I see my mom quite often. Like, already. Just because we, like, work. I mean, she does the VOD channel and stuff. And I mean, I'm not seeing any other family. <laughs> and I never leave the house. But I'll check. I'll check if I'm not even allowed to. I might not- I might not even be allowed to. If I'm not allowed to, I won't. I'm not gonna, like, break the rules. BC... Christmas... COVID. Let's see. What do they say? I don't know. I'll look into it. How do you get your groceries? Uh, I don't get groceries. I pay my roommates to get groceries and cook for me. It works great. Yeah, lazy man. Here's the thing. I'm not lazy. I cooked for myself, Chef Chris. Yeah. I cooked for myself. It's just one day. One day. Chris was like, yo, all you do is work. Do you want me to like just cook so you have more time? Free time so like you don't have to worry about cooking every day because you work so much? And I was like, sure. Sure, what, what's fair to pay you for that? And then figured something out and I mean... They're, they're, like, roommates are great at cooking. And literally all they do is they just make twice the amount of food they would normally eat. And there's it's not, not a butler, okay? It's so nice? Yeah. Like, my roommates are so nice. They're, they're, they're... All friggin' incredible. Alright. Uh, wait, is this the, to the gym leader? Nope. Is this your full-time job? Content creation, yes. Yeah, I guess we're battling this guy. Is Chris a like your mom? No. Chris is not like my mom. My mom has two working arms. <laughs> <laughs> I got one good arm. <laughs> he just got surgery on his shoulder. <laughs> that was Chris. <laughs> <laughs> Does he also tuck you into bed at night? I don't think so. Uh, I guess we'll switch because this is not gonna do much damage. What just happened? Chris broke into my room because he, I said he doesn't have two working arms. Is all it was. What happened to his shoulder? Uh, it it got he dislocated a lot. <clears throat> All right, Ash can handle this. Alexander, thanks to the prime man. Water pulse, perfect. Chris skips arm day. Oh no, no, he does not skip arm day. That is the last. No, he is insanely strong. Honestly, I bet Chris. Could do a literally like one finger pull up. Like he literally went too hard on arms, I would say. <laughs> like he got right. I don't know if he can still hear me. You can do a one finger pull up, right? I don't know if he can still hear me. He came from the other room. Tell him to do it right now. No. What? You can do a one one finger pull up. I can do one arm, one finger. Pull up. One arm, one finger pull up. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah. 
Can you beat me in arm wrestling? Nope. <laughs> He's got alien long arms. It's not fair. <laughs> Like, look, it's his, his, his arms are just like two times the length. I can't get any leverage on no, the short arms make it easier, though. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> There's no way you can do a one-figure pull-up? No, he can. Trust me, I, like, he can do it. My dad can beat your dad up! Yeah, I'm, he's like a rock climber. I don't know, he's climbed like V13s or something insane like that. Like five, five thirteens? Five four? I don't know. I'm not sure if it was 13 or 14. <clears throat> V13 and 514 are very different. When did you meet him? First day of university. Actually, I met him on the first day of university. We sat in the front of the class together and he's like, Hey, you got those coupons for that rock climbing place? And I was like, yeah. He's like, you want to go? I was like, why not? Sure. And so we went and then he kept going and I stopped. But I mean, I, I think I climbed up to a V7 myself. Six? Seven? No, yeah, seven. Do you, study, do you still study in uni? No, I did two years and took a break. Can you tell an injury story time? Sure. Um... Let me think, let me think. There's, there's probably some good injury, injury stuff that I can talk about. Hmm... Do you guys call it university in Canada? I don't that I don't know if most people call it uni. People just say university. Uni. I don't hear uni very often. Lies, you probably did a 5-7? No, a V7. I mostly did bouldering. V10 and 513. There we go. Small ant roommate, he's right there. Yeah, he's done a V10 and a 513. There we go. Thanks for clearing that up. For anyone that knows what rock climbing is. At sign's actually kind of carrying right now. Love seeing Pan and Chung hanging out with that small ant. It's pretty cool, right? You know what's crazy about- so anyone that knows about rock climbing... Is- I, I, I just said he had surgery on his shoulder because it, it popped out like at any point. It would just fall out of his shoulder or whatever. His arm would just fall off. It's not really an exaggeration. I'm pretty sure he did most of those with like mostly one arm. Because the other arm would just fall out. So if anyone's like a rock climber, you know that that's like, it's a pretty big deal. He's pretty good. <clears throat> Is his arm sewed on? I think they sewed it back together, yeah? Whose back spread is that? I think it's a Waylord. How many times did he dislocate it? It got, I think it, yeah, they stapled it back on. I think it got to the point where if he wasn't like physically flexing his arm, it would just dis get dislocated. Like if he wasn't flexing, I would imagine his shoulder muscles to hold it in. It would just fall out, I think. It was, it was bad, which is why surgery. 513 is near the top of the hardest rating in climbing, apparently, yeah. Just perma-flexing. You just have one shoulder that's just... <laughs> uh. Did you do outdoor climbing? I really didn't do any, no. 
This gym is long? It is a long gym, yeah. And you never told the story? I don't- oh crap, I don't know if there's any stories I can tell. Ben Castle, thanks for the five months, by the way. Okay, um, I guess we'll just one attack here. Wait, why is there an Azumarill in the Steel-type gym? Does this have, like, Iron Tail or something? Never broken any bones? I've broken my nose and my toe, but I've told those stories before. <clears throat> 513 is ambiguous because there's 13A and th to 13D. The difficulty is immense. I'm not sure what the difference is. I'm not sure which one specifically. Um... Oh, we gotta... Okay. Have you ever had to stay in the hospital for an extended period? Yes! There is Iron Tail. The most sick I have ever been was, um... I remember it was... I think it was summer in between grade 11 and grade 12. I believe. And I... had a bit of a sore throat that was just getting worse and worse and worse and I was just exhausted. And uh, I, I went to the the hospital, and they're like, "Looks like nothing's wrong. You'll get over it." Corona, monk. But and yeah, they said nothing was wrong. And I ended up, we ended up going on holidays. Like we went on a road trip, so we drove for like a few days to go visit some family. And, uh, it just got worse. You know, I, I, it got to the point where, like, I was having trouble eating food. Because I, it hurt too much. And I was exhausted. I was sleeping just all the time. And... Then we went to the, the, the doctor again. And they were like, there's nothing we can do. Have some morphine. And so the doctor prescribed me some morphine. And when they went to fill it in... They filled it in wrong. So we had to go back to the... We went back to the hospital that next day. And they're like, so we have this prescription, they filled it in wrong. And the doctor looked at it and was like, what? Why do he give you morphine? Here, well, let's do a test. And they did a test. It turns out I had mono and a really, really bad case of tonsillitis at the same time. Yeah, the pharmacy wouldn't give the prescription because it, the, the form that the doctor had was filled in wrong. I had mono and tonsillitis that was really bad at the same time. And so I, I got some... And basically... Well, they can't do anything for mono because that's a virus. And like my, you could literally see my like tonsils like falling apart. It was bad. So I ended up just eating like soft foods. I had like really soft canned pastas and like applesauce and yogurt for like two weeks. I think I lost like 20 pounds and I weighed like 140 at six feet tall or something like that. I lost like a ton of weight in like a super short amount of time and it was it was rough but I just slept most of the time for the trips that I was there. I basically just slept like 18 20 hours a day. Did you have Chef Boyardee? Oh absolutely. Dadimus Prime. Thanks for the Prime. Uh, I think we can do this gym without going back. Let's see. But yeah, it was rough. But yeah, I never had morphine. I never ended up getting the morphine. They were just like, just take some Tylenol. And it'll be good in, a, in probably like a week or two. I think I might have had some antibiotics for the, the tonsillitis or something. I can't remember. But I remember taking those pills. It sucked. Like, I couldn't talk either. It was bad. We have one Moo Moo Milk and one Hyper Potion. Let's friggin' go for it. 
What is mono? Mononucleosis? I'm not exactly sure. Yo, Ozzy, stream's been good. Oh yeah, I actually, in that, I actually had to go to the hospital because I got so dehydrated. They had to put like a, a thing in my arm to give me like liquids. Cause I couldn't drink enough water. Like it was, it was bad. An IV, yeah, they had to give me an IV. Cause I couldn't, I couldn't drink. Oh, seriously? We got like nothing here. Alright, beat up. I think beat up is... Yeah, we have a few Pokemon. But that's doing nothing. Is it all my Pokemon that I have alive still? Mm, I'm not sure how many Pokemon we have alive. Whatever. Beat up's a weird move. We don't have a fire move on Pretzel, apparently, which sucks, but Zoe can handle a bronze ore. We got this. Hypnosis, it does nothing. We're gonna try rollout. It's gonna miss a bunch of hypnosis. We got this, we got this. Balm? Not very effective, doesn't matter. Flash cannon. Oh! We're water type. That should do nothing, right? I know I'm level 23. We could survive that. <laughs> uh. And it'll double every turn. Never mind, it hypnosis us. Uh. Zoe, what are you doing? What is she doing? Okay, um... Turn up check moves. You're a water type. Come on. <laughs> Alright, Ash. I'd, uh, let's hope it has heat proof. It has levitate. No, okay. Alright, alright, sure, yep, yeah. uh-huh. Brian away! We can take those hits, we can take those hits all day. Brian! Flash cannon! Ah. We can take one more, right? One HP? Ooh, Ooh baby, let's go! Gabe, thanks for the seven. No problem. All right. Pretzel gets some. Ash gets some. Very little. Steelix, will we switch? Sure. Um, I'm going to switch Pretzel in. I'm switching Pretzel in. And I'm literally just going to use Pretzel to heal up my other Pokemon. Like, Pretzel is just gonna heal up Ash. I'm sorry, Pretzel, but you're going down. Gyro Ball, that might not even KO. Wow, that... Why did you not use a Ground-type move? Okay. Uh, we'll just bite. Hope for the flinch if we outspeed. Because that's gonna do very little. It flinched! Another flinch, maybe? Sandstorm, no not a big deal. Bite, flinch, nope, gyro ball. Yikes, sandstorm taking me out. Not quite, okay, we get one more in. I think we'll beat up. And the dragon breath takes me out. Okay. Now we need to send an Ash, and Ash's brine needs to carry. It, uh, that, we just need Brian to carry. Ash? Why are you so fast? Why did you outspeed a Steelix? What's going on? Did it use, like, Dragon Tail or something? Dragon Breath? Why? You're level 28. Why do you outspeed? What? That's weird. 
Anyways, Brian, full restore. Brian should KO it now. Yep. Steelix is slow. I didn't realize Steelix was that slow. There we go. Ash, level 28. He took on a level 36 Steelix. Ash, kind of killing it. Kind of killing it. Oop. Okay. Bastiodon. Uh, we should be able to... Oh, God. It's level 39. Jesus. Brian. We outspeed? I don't know how, but we outspeed. Does an okay amount. If we get two more hits in, we should KO it. Yes, it uses iron defense. If we can hit two more times, we gotta get one more hit, and then Brian will be double damage. Find the gold blocks. <laughs> Ancient power, that shouldn't KO. Okay, don't get the boosts. I think we've won, because Brian should do, 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 do double damage now. I know Mudshot is four times, but it's a physical move. We need to use special moves, because he used Iron Defense. Which is why I just used Brian to get the badge with a level 29 Amistar. No problems. Easy. Look at that. Mudshot special? Oh, my bad. <laughs> right, is it Mud Bomb that's physical? One of them's physical. Never, you're right. Mudshot might be special. Whatever. We won. Do, 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 do. No, they're both special? Oh. Huh. I guess I'm confused. This is a huge gym. Yo, what's up? That's, are you gonna give me strength? <laughs> Hopefully they give me strength soon. Yeah, we, what level was that? Level 39? We're a little bit under level now. Just jump off the edge, you'll respawn at the entrance, right? Oh yeah, that's how it works. Bruh, Reggie Gigas. Nice. Strength is in the cave island thing? It's not in the cave island thing. Iron Island is not where you get strength. Strength is in a different place. I'm not exactly sure where it is, but it is not there. You're thinking about Pokemon Platinum. You guys are thinking about Pokemon Platinum. Pokemon Platinum has it there, but not in this game. Just got a clean drug test, small ant. It's so way weird, Mr. Quinn. Got a clean drug test. That feels like announcing that means you expected it to not be clean. Right? Because like that, the expected result would be to just not bring it up because it doesn't matter, right? I guess congrats for not doing drugs. I. Uh, it's just, it's weird to bring it up. Hmm. All right. Yeah. <laughs> do 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 do. Okay. Where, where's the explosion? Where's the doom? Could you guys doom for me? Or does it not doom in this one? Oh, it does doom in this one. Okay. Doom. It doesn't make the doom sound effect in this one though. It doesn't doesn't have the doom text. It do be dooming. That tremor wasn't a natural occurrence, was it? Something happened, there's a huge explosion. Oh kaboom, there it is. Okay, doomer. Row and the man can't sit still, blah 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 blah. Wonder what happened? I don't know. Let's fly though. Fly. You can lift me up. Boop boop. 
Wait, 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 wait a minute. Emily, yes, I'm not gonna get rid of Chatter. That's such a nice cry. Okay, we need to make Chatter do the maximum amount of damage, though. Uh, the louder you speak, the more damage this move does. Fair warning. Ah! <clears throat> you can do better? I can do better. I can do better. Perfect. <laughs> Emily learned a new saying. <laughs> now that's power. <laughs> Alright, let's go to Valor. I should probably get this first. <laughs> Jesus. At least once. I don't know if it even picked it up. We'll use it in battle. We'll see if it picked it up. <laughs> Let's try it once. I don't know if this picked it up. I, I, it's hard to say if I don't know if this mic is set up properly, but we'll see. Okay, here we go. Oh, I didn't pick it up at all. No. That's so sad. Eat two blanks the tier one. It didn't even pick up the sound at all. Sad, dude. And it's gone forever. Yeah, I don't have the mic set up. <clears throat> if we get it again, we'll do it. <laughs> <clears throat> if we get it again, I'll set it up. <clears throat> sad land forever. I will take a chip. And be sad. Yo, Reggie Gigas, get it together, dude. Superpower. Can you test the in-game mic somehow? I don't think so. And was that from the plate on the floor? No. It's from a bag of chips I have in the drawer. Show us. Um, Zoe, you can handle a shell us. Those are salt and vinegar chips. Um, stop. Canadians call them chips, not crisps. Although crisps do make sense. Uh oh. We're fine. We're fine. Sorry, I skipped the best guy in the game. My bad. 
Those chips are wretched. No, they're so good. Oval stone, nice. Be great to throw that out later. What's up, Am Dad Ghostface? Hello, welcome. Lionel Spencer, thanks for the 11 months, by the way. Dude, that's crazy. At sign is a legendary. Quite nice. Alright, we need to switch our weakest Pokemon up front. Merns, thanks to the Prime. Appreciate the support. Thank you so much. Yeah, only one of our Pokemon is low level now. It's just Zoe. Let's raise up Zoe. Zoe was really good at the start of the stream. We gotta get we gotta get Zoe back up on track. Maya, thanks for the two. Hey. What do we got? Zoe? Ponyta, okay. Okay, not bad. Um, well, Ember. Mean look, not a problem. Easy, dude. Double Sfeel. Double Sfeel. It's gone now. Double Hypno. Double Hypno. Roughneck Kirby sent out a Cleffa. That is so funny. Just the most intimidating guy just with the Cleffa. It's the best. Love that. <laughs> so we gained some EXP. Gua! Me too, man. Me too. What's your favorite chip flavor? Salt and vinegar, my man. Revive? I have not had any revives yet. That's kind of useful, honestly. Okay. Salt and vinegar, are you a masochist? Yeah. It's great. They're tasty. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. The best part is that they hurt your mouth. Sandhoom? I miss. Nice. Dragon Claw. You drink vinegar also? Yeah, why not? How are they so underleveled? I neglected to do this earlier in their game. And I think they'll gradually get stronger. I'm just gonna take this out real quick. Should be pretty simple. Pichu... Sweet kiss, confused and paralyzed. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. Nice. Okay. Good. Who wouldn't like vinegar and chips? I know, they're so good. I'm playing Pokemon Sword. WTF has a Cramorant. It just spat a Pikachu at me. I don't know. I don't know. Alright, uh, Pursuit! Wait, wasn't Zoe low on health or something? Hmm. Hmm. Why do you speed up the game? I do, but if I speed it up, it's really hard to edit for YouTube. So I speed up the parts that are boring, and I'm not gonna put on YouTube. Honestly, some of the parts that I speed up, I put on YouTube too, though. Go Zoe, E, Water Gun, Bonds, Lee. Zoe is getting the perfect type. Yeah, I must have switched out. When he lost the shiny Gibble, I never had a shiny Gibble. That was a regular colored Gibble. Counter Monte Cristo, thanks to the Prime. If they're shiny, they stay shiny. We'll have a shiny Pokemon every battle. That's a double battle, okay. Okay. Ponyta, Weasel, Bell and Paw. Was that was that Bell and Pop, Ma and Pop or something? What was that trainer class? I didn't even see that. 
You have... No, you don't have Levitate. Okay, we're gonna Rock Throw you. And you are going to... Shadow Sneak the Buizel. Congrats on one mil subs, thank you. Okay, Shadow Sneak the Buizel. Does a lot of damage. Ember, rock throw, easy KOs, dude. Good, no problems. No problems, we found return. That might actually be kind of useful, yeah. Does your levels stay the same? Yep, levels, IVs, EVs, percentage of your stats and stuff, it's all good. What do you give me? Take this cleanse tag, thank you old lady. Does this other lady give me something good? Like, something useful that we might be able to use? Well, there we go. We got strength. From an old lady in a tower. That's so weird. I forget that diamond does that. It makes you go into this tower. Interesting. Do we have an escape rope? We do not. Do we have dig? Check this out. Do we have dig? Do we have dig? Do we have dig? Big boy Fletch, thanks for the 19 months. I'll do one more before I just run down. Platinum is the best version, I agree. No dig, sad dude. How many emotes? They're Lickle. Lickle emotes, or Lysel. She's great. We don't have an escape rope, unfortunately. It's still official time to speed up? I, I don't care. It's not a speed run. It's not like you submit this to a leaderboard. Just so people know how much of the stream they've missed. And that's so people who know how long it would take on sped up. Okay, Mistreva's Murkrow, Pretzel and Zoe. Oh, the dynamic duo, Pretzel and Zoe. Um, ancient power, although it's a special- oh, that's a special move. That sucks. Uh, we're going to do that. And um, honestly, we're just gonna reflect with Zoe. Hopefully we survive. Ancient power. Nice. Confuse ray, reflect. Assurance, the mistrievous. And we're gonna mock punch. Good job, Zoe. You did something. Defeated Mike and Nat. Excellent! What kind of leaderboards are there for random team Diamond Pearl speedruns? There aren't. There aren't. That's the thing. Yo, we got a Mew and a Darkrai? Both legendary Pokemon and definitely not mythical Pokemon. Pretty cool. They're not mythical, okay? Ginger the Great, thanks for the Prime. And O Time Phrase, thanks for the Prime as well. Or the tier, not, not Prime, the tier one. Thank you. Zen Headbutt, dude. This Pokemon got so much better with the, just the addition of Zen Headbutt. Because it's like a physical psychic type, right? Muse mythical? No, 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 no. The definition of mythical Pokemon is that you need to do their, their like, Base stats, I think, are like a hundred, uh, all a hundred or something, or at least most of them have that. The mythical Pokemon is that you cannot get them in game just by doing stuff in game. Okay, right? You have to do a real life thing. Yo, stinky boys, you have to do a, a real life thing. Gustavitos, thanks for the tier one. It's, it's a big event. When in, when... Uh, mythical Pokemon or event Pokemon, exactly. To get Darkrai, you don't need to go through an event. You can just do a, a thing similar to uh, how you got the Regis. You bike in a certain spot, take a certain path. You can go into this mystery zone and go through this big invisible maze for 
for like a for like 30 minutes it's a huge maze you just save the game turn it off turn it back on and there you go dark rise in front of you no need for any fancy events works great it's a glitch it's not a glitch that's where you're supposed to get dark cry easier said than done I did it Same thing with Mew. You just fly when you hit a certain trainer. You go, you fight a slowpoke thing, and there's the Mew. It appears on the bridge. How do you learn vibrato whistling? You just wiggle your tongue. It's not that bad. Oh yeah, or you can just get Mew under the truck. That's that's it. Levels are gonna calm down a bit. Yeah, I I guess the levels slow down quite a lot because there's no way we fight like level 50s. Just vibrate the tongue, dude. All right, we're gonna save save the game. How long does Mystery Zone glitch take again? Like an hour or two. Depends. I think Dark Rai takes like a. Uh, f like, I don't know. I can't remember. Close civilization, twin leaf, unopposed. Look at those sad Magikarps. Just trying to live their lives, but they're dead. Okay, Crit City. Thanks to the seven. I guess we'll save before we fight this guy. Although our team, I think, will be able to handle Commander Mar. Right? This- this is Mars? Who is this? Saturn? Commander Saturn. We can destroy Saturn. It's not gonna be a problem. We'll send in our pretzel. For alligator has crunch? Nope. It has ice fang. Shockwave, dude? Okay. Uh, sorry, Pretzel, but you're probably done. You survived. Freeze. Get the freeze. Come on. I know you wanna. Make this easy on me. Freeze. Ooh, it feels good. Outplayed. Honestly, outplayed. GG. Pretzel's got that power. Pretzel's got that level. But is it in bronze or will I switch? Sure, why not? Do we have any fire types? Nope. We have Ad Sign. Ad Sign probably has curse though. Curse? Oh, we have Will-O-Wisp. That's good enough. It missed. Never mind. Rock Tomb. This is not gonna do much. Yeah, we're fine. Will-O-Wisp now. Shadow Ball. Yikes. <sighs> the coverage that these Pokemon have is absurd. Um, Emily, I guess. Emily, always a legendary. Apparently. Uh, exerting pressure. Time to exert some extreme pressure onto this Bronzor with an ominous wind. Emily might get the boosts. Might not. It's like a 50-50. Emily did not get the boosts. Okay. Boosts? Boosts. Wait for it. Last one's gonna give me some boosts. Check this out, right here. Daryl, thanks for the prime. 
Either you get the booster or not, it's 50-50. Okay? Ah, Commander Sanders about to send Toxic Croak while I switch. Okay, I'll send an Ash, because Toxic Croak can't do anything about that. Yee! Thanks for the Prime. Appreciate it. Isn't it 1 in 10? Yeah, it's 10%. It is 10%. Okay, let's see what you got. Ash, level 37. That's what you're fighting against. We are going to body slam to try and paralyze. It is going to faint attack. It's going to do nothing. It's going to do nothing. That's a crit. Yes. It should have done nothing. Boom, 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 boom. No paralysis. We can take another faint attack. We can also take a poison jab. It's not a problem. No big deal. Paralysis juicy. All right, Ash. Finish this thing off now. Body slam. Crit, maybe. Not quite. Has a citrus berry. That sucks. Revenge. No big deal. Okay. Took out Ash. But I guess we'll just send in the big boy. And by the big boy, I mean the big girl. Emily. We can just fly. Dum, dum, dum. Yeah. We just fly. Tries to poison jab. It does nothing. It's a fighting type. And we take it out. Sky dig, of course. Hmm. That didn't take it out. Well, I guess it is seven levels above me. That's fair. There we go. Fly. Mud bomb just came to the stream. Is this Nuzlocke? No. No. I'm just trying to beat the game with a random team every battle. Easy. Emily gained EXP. We're done the battle. And we defeated Saturn. Okay. Blah, blah, blah. Universe, Lake Verity. Alright, so now we go to Lake Verity. I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick, though. So I'm gonna play that ad. Go to the bathroom. Be right back. Sound good? So we're not done the stream yet. Not even close. I'll be right back. more water. We'll see.
I forgot to fill up my water, but I got a, I got a candy cane though. What's up? Okay, there we go. How are you guys? What's up? Welcome back, thank you. Vibe to Team Galactic with us? It's pretty good though, right? Okay. Never tried candy cane. They're like, okay. Congrats, becoming a panda. Thanks. Appreciate it. Pluck, more like go away because we're learning fly yo Jariki giving a tier 3 sub appreciate it my hair oh yes my one strand of hair beautiful um wait we need to go here now yeah tier 3 that's crazy so the uh, the sub point count the sub counter now I figured uh, the sub point, the sub counter now, I am using it, but it, it tracks like the number of subs, not sub points anymore. Just because I, I couldn't get it to work with sub points anymore. Um, we're actually almost at 10,000 sub points again. Pretty crazy. Boom, boom, boom. Do, 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 do. What's the difference? Um, a tier three sub is worth six sub points, and a tier two sub is worth two. That's just ten k sub points is the 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 moment which you unlock sixty emotes. We already unlocked those because we reached that before, but it's crazy getting back there because it's just a it's a huge number. Uh, I'm choking on the candy cane. Not like seriously choking, but I can feel it. <sighs> I guess it'll just dissolve eventually, right? I'll just ignore it. Spidey dude, two months? You've been sub for two months. Let's go, dude. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Okay. Silkoon and Glamio? I mean, okay. We have... A Zapdos and a Heatran to handle that. <laughs> I really don't think this is going to be too much of an issue if I had to guess. <clears throat> this is like an actually good team. We're just going to destroy. Okay. Okay. Doesn't matter, but the level's nice. Use assist but failed because there's no more members of your team, Glamiel. <laughs> uh. Alright. Gold bet! Oh, we don't have any. Unfortunately, we don't have any moves to handle that, but. This is fine. We'll just do this. Chunky Monkey is falling. Now he's there. Alright. Yo, MC Mumu, thanks for the five bucks. A little donation from a French viewer. I don't understand all, but the majority. It's pretty cool to learn English watching a cool streamer. P.S. A French phrase that I don't know what it means. <laughs> thanks for the donation, I appreciate it. Yeah, there's no electric moves on this. Zoe level 25 heat trend. Zoe's pretty powerful, okay? Diamond Polo is super slow in comparison to play, yeah. It's alright though. Someone didn't study French? No, I did 12 years of French in in school. I think I did 12 full years. I don't know any French.
It's amazing how, like, you try and learn a language, or if you put through school for a language that you don't want to learn, you just don't remember any of it. It's crazy how that works. Huh. Yo, that's weird? Yeah. Like, I, 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 you're required to do it for at least eight years, but I mean, it looks good for, like, universities if you do, like, if you do it all the way through. So I was like, sure, I'll do it all the way through. That's easy. And are you bald today? Yes. I am today. Look, I have no hairline, it just keeps going. I am bald. Ignore th ignore that. I am bald. Why? Um, I don't know. I, I, all the cool kids are doing it these days. Stupid worm, makes 100 bits. Chunky Runky should go to school to get a PhD in Yeetology, then we'll have to call him Dr. Runky. Yeah, that could work. That is an idea. Is Zoe still out front? Zoe, what are you doing? Zoe, be out front. There we go, that's a little bit better. Frick, congrats for getting into Panda. Thanks. Thank you. Became bald because of Esam. He's got a good look. Northern Lion 2. They got good looks going on. I just I want to emulate that myself. How do you wear a beanie? I put it on my head. How long have you been streaming? Uh, 20 minutes or so? I've been streaming about 20 minutes. So much for only switching teams for HMs? Well, I needed to switch my team around to get Zoe out front. I want Zoe in the front slot. We gotta do it eventually. Wait, was I not paying attention and used a move that's not... that doesn't do anything on Stunky? Oh yeah, I'm dumb. My bad. Um... Leech life, stunky. Wing attack, stunky. There we go. What's up, Am365? <clears throat> Minecraft after Pokemon. I, I'm feeling tired today. I might do just Pokemon. I mean, we're playing Minecraft tomorrow as well. Assist, what's this? Attract. Yikes. Okay. Yikes. Oh, God. Okay, this is fine. We're still out to the Pokemon still kind of straight. Nope, we fixed that. Wow, Leash Life does so little damage. <laughs> it's so bad. It is so bad. We'll continue to wing attack. Okay. You're mobilized, but you're not even attacking the Glamio. How long ago was this game made? Uh, 2006. 2006. Boom, 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 14 years ago. <clears throat> Pretty insane, right? There we go. Took out the stunky at the very least, getting the XP for that. I mean, I was still charming. Doesn't really affect me. Oh, they have they have Pokemon. Okay. Um. Immobilized by love. Taken out by swipes. 
We have 14 years. Pretty absurd. Wow, they just fury swiped me down to death, huh? That's all right. We got a, we actually got a pretty pog team right now. It's like the most middle tier team right now. Zatu, Sharpedo, Dodrio, Ursa Ring. Like this is like the middle tier team. Like it's not terrible, but it's not good. Uh, sure. We'll use me first, I guess. Um, I will use Fury Attack on you. Fury swipes, perfect. It missed. Lovely. Ah. All right, there we go. Crit, Pog, dude. This is your first Pokemon game. It's held up well. It is. Any any like really stylized games hold up really well because like the the how it looks is the charm of it. At sign getting stronger. We'd love to see it. Are you using an emulator or DS? I'm using a DS. <laughs> nice DS, thank you. Thank you, that's only one screen. <laughs> what do you mean? I'm just holding the control part. Is there a chance your team could be shiny? If there's a chance we encounter a shiny, you can catch it. The man with 70 as lights pulls out a Game Boy Advance? I... I don't have that many. The level's random too? No. I'm saving that for later. Yeah, if we get one shiny, it stays shiny the entire run. That's just an S? That's just a- yeah, DS stands for dual screen. Did you guys know that? So just have- this is my- my Dennis is on here. If anyone's curious. I- I still have it on my desk. I haven't put it away from when I took it out for that one video. Do 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 Dennis the Pidgey, yup. You know, you know. Do 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 do. All right, what you got? Did you lose? Did you actually lose? Got a whole lot of trouble for that incident. Okay, Mars. Yes. Blah. Okay, no, never mind. Apparently, Lucas does nothing. Huh. Pandatron, you got to do the challenge now. Golbat, Zoe. What do we got? I wasn't even paying attention. Slackoth. Slackoth ain't too bad. I mean, not... I mean, 12 levels below is kind of bad. Let's use Turnip, the evolved form. Alright. Oh yeah, sorry, Vigoroth. I had that backwards, my bad. Look at... <laughs> Slacking... With the, uh, pick in his nose. I love it. It's so good. Status healers. We do have an antidote. I will use the antidote. It's gonna try and bite me. And now we faint attack. Never mind. We slack off. I, I guess we're loafing around. Faint attack. Come on. Don't flinch. Don't be confused. Okay. It's gonna be a long battle, it seems. Okay, please, just let me just snap out. Oh my god, turn up! Good. Yo, that's a lot of health. Faint attack. The toxic to me again. Snapped out of confusion. Finally. And it does no damage. Okay. 
Okay. Alright, okay. Alright, the turnip was useless and, uh... At sign... Doesn't Covet do more damage? Wait. Covet is a damaging move? Oh! They do the exact same amount. They do the exact same amount. Huh. Um... Wait, why did I switch? What? Brain, are you okay? Apparently it's not okay. Iron defense. Iron defense. Alright. Now we clamp. Attack. Hit it. Not yourself. Oh my god. We flinched. We might lose this battle. We might lose this battle. Uh, except we have ancient power. Maybe not. If we get the boost here, we could win. If we get the it's so 10% chance. If we get the boost, it misses supersonic. Boost again? No. Alright, now we side beam. <laughs> Woo! There we go. This... Took it out. Excellent! Zoe leveled up. Very nice. Add sign. EXP. We do have to fight, uh, two more Pokemon. Yikes. Um, and Perugly probably has a Dark-type move. Ah ha 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 ha. That's with the defense boost, dude. Self-destruct. Uh... Ah. Pretzel! Poison Powder! Slash, that might be a KO. Prugly is a monster. Not a KO. Poison Powder does hit. Stun Spore might have been the play. Hard to say, though. Mega Drain. It tries to Hypnosis me? Okay. Killer Pants, actually the 5. That might allow us to take one more Slash. I mean, we're taking one faint attack for sure. Come on, Gar villain, thanks for the tier one. Okay, we may be able to win. Uh, that's the citrus berry, isn't it? Yikes. Ah. Goes for another hypnosis. I mean, that's just poison damage. This is just poison damage. More turns. We have no more healing items at all. We have a revive, but I don't know how... I did not mean to run there. Um, apparently, you can't press up on that menu. That takes us out. Uh, Emily will come out. <laughs> I'm gonna use the revive to try and make this work. We're gonna revive Turnip. Macros, thanks to the Prime. Not very... F is that... We can survive one, right? Our defense is high. Yes. It continues to get poisoned. Okay. 
Pardon? It goes for hypnosis. Huh. Okay. Sure. I mean, I'm fine with this. Probably hurt by poison. What's the last Pokemon? I don't know. Let's find out. Like a Bronzor, maybe? Might be a Bronzor. Yeah, it's a Bronzor. Level... 37. It's quite a lot, actually. Uh, we're gonna start by slacking off or Amnesia. I'm gonna slack off to start. That does nothing. Now we will Amnesia. Good. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I think we can win this. Turnip is so strong. And Bronzor is so weak. All right, so our special defense is gonna go up a little more. Loafing around. Turn yourself confusion. Oh my God. Slack off, loafing around. Slack off, okay, good. Good. <laughs> do we have a full heal? We do have one full heal. I'm gonna use that for the confusion. Okay, now we can faint attack. It hits, does. I guess he has used iron defense a few times. This is gonna take a while. That's a crit. Damn. Uh, confuse Ray hit, please. No. No. No! Don't get it in confusion! Yes! <laughs> of course, Vayne Attack hits, so it doesn't always hit through confusion. Slag off. Come on! No! Stop it! Confused? Stop! You've gotta be kidding me! What is this confusion rate? Stop down a confusion! Let's go! <laughs> Oh my god. It's like off. Ace of Sensory. Okay, we're back at full health. <laughs> and a Confuse Raise. Okay, not not much slack offs left. Faint attack. We're loafing around. Yes, we hit a faint attack. Get a crit, get a crit. Make this easy, get a crit. Please, 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 please. Mm, okay, okay. Snapped out of confusion, faint attack. That's a crit! Oh, let's go. <laughs> faint attack, loafing around, confuse rate. Marissa, thank you for the raid. Welcome back everybody from Mrs. Marissa's stream. Random Pokemon every battle, that's what I'm doing right now. We're trying to defeat a level 34, 37 bronze ore with a 33 turnip that's picking his nose. What's up? Come on, come on. <sighs> I'm fighting uh, Mars right now. Admin Mars or whatever their name is. We're loafing around. Snapped out of confusion, faint attack, beautiful. Hopefully Marissa's team went well today. All right, extra sensory. No big deal. Loafing around. Let's heal. We're slacked off. Feeling good? Aquinas, thanks for the nine months. I appreciate the support. All right, take this out. Loafing around, whatever. Uh. Come on. Loaf around. I forgot. Stabbed out of confusion, we faint attack. Come on. One more crit.
This is kind of absurd how long this battle is taking. But I think we have a win. Unless we get terribly unlucky. Like, they need to start critting and I need to start getting hit in confusion 100% of the time. But we snapped out! Here we go! Maybe one more. We should use a slack off. Slacked off. Excellent. Yeah, log Logmania. I think it's you, right? Logan? Yep. Yep. This is taking comically long. It's a little bit absurd. Already confused. Faint attack. I think it only has Confuse right now. But it doesn't matter because we just took it out, right? Easy battle. Turnip took it out. Level 33. Slacking is pretty good. He didn't even attack every second turn, which is absurd. Took Mars out. Very nice. Wind works. Verity. All right, and cavern, mesprit, whatever. Easy to catch, being of emotion, beings of whatever. Okay. Now we need to go up to Lake Acuity, which is a bit of a journey, and I need to fly up there, so we're just gonna boop, boop, and here. Uh, I think Ash can fly. Yep. Thanks, Ash. Get rid of follow me. How you doing? I'm doing well. Doing very well. Nope. Oh. This is only taking so long because you were saying earlier that we're gonna get through the game so quickly. Maybe that could be the thing. I think we go up from Celestic Town, and that allows us to go through this route. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Ad? I actually can't play an ad for another 12 minutes. So... Yeah, how many badges do you have? We have six badges. Nope. No, 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 no. Just riding a dead tokenic? It's just asleep. Just whip it around like a helicopter? It's great. Works so good every time. Small and watching your old videos, how are you able to get hundreds of thousands of views on YouTube, but only a couple of hundred Twitch viewers? Well, something you have to keep in mind... ...is that those videos didn't have hundreds of thousands of views yet. They had like... ...20,000 views. And you know, maybe... ...1% of people, 2% of people went over from those 20,000? That's 200. And, like, not everyone is Twitch, not everyone wants to go over from another platform. And there's a difference between, like, the total views on something and someone currently viewing. Like, if we go to how many people views yesterday's stream, we'll check. Let's go and check how many people watched yesterday's stream. Total. Let's go, uh... I'm just gonna go to... where is it? Here? Click on that. Ah, there we go. Yeah, yesterday's stream is 100,000 views. 100,000 people went to yesterday's stream. Right? Not everyone watches all the videos at the exact same time. And not everyone is able to watch the streams because the time doesn't line up. Alright. Just gonna speed through this. Time zone matters as well, yeah. YouTube, you can watch its total for all the time, and Twitch is just live. Alright. We won against that bird keeper. Zoe actually managed to win there. Whoop. We have strength now, which is nice. 100,000? Yeah, 100,000 people visited the stream yesterday. Which is insane, right? 
Zoe. Sorry, Zoe, you're switching. And because I stream for six hours plus, I don't necessarily stream for that long. Today, I think I might... I might not stream for as long, because I'm, I'm really tired today for some reason. I'm like... I'm just taken out of me. We'll see. Iron defense. Uh... I think Brine is better than Water Pulse. Like, even before. We'll see. There we go. Now Brian will take it out. I guess you're just that good. A lot of people get a lot of views. People don't go back to their older stuff. Even PewDiePie has videos with maybe 20k views, so you just wondered. Yeah, I mean, I try to make all of my videos really, like, entertaining. Like, I try to do everything. Just drink coffee. I don't want to have to rely on coffee, though. I don't want to. It's a slippery slope. Coffee doesn't really work? No, coffee 100% works. Is it this way? Do I just- do I just go this way? You think I do? Let's hope this is right. Uh... I guess we can just use strength here. Boom! Be an alpha and drink tea? I don't know, I prefer coffee over tea. Tensa, thanks for the two months. Appreciate the support. Is this the right way? I think this is. Yeah, we just have defog to deal with. Tea spear in every way, except taste. Tea tastes worse. I'm sorry. Coffee just tastes better. All right, now we have one third chance to miss every turn. I'm not going to use defog. I am not going to use defog. I would use rock blast. We have ice shard and... You know, I'm going to grass whistle. We missed. Alright. Sure. Are you a dark coffee or a cream guy? Um, I just have black coffee usually. Like, I don't put anything in it. I have ADHD and coffee doesn't make me more energetic. Yeah, for me, coffee makes me more focused than anything else. Like, I can actually, like... I can focus on stuff. It's great. Most of the time. Yo. Glad you like the content. Of Cosmos, thanks for the six. Hiya. Okay, Turnip should be able to handle this. Right? Yo, Hypnosis Dream Eater combo? Beautiful. Love it. Man, I remember when I was a kid, I had made the just the most dumb set. It was really annoying. I had a level 100 Blissey as a kid that I trained up. I taught it double team, soft boiled, Hypnosis, and Dream Eater. It was the most annoying Pokemon, but god was it funny to fight my friends with. And I think the- I think it had like a big root or something for the item it was holding. <laughs> it was so funny. Yeah. No guard Machamp says what? They didn't have Machamps. They had their starter. Level 100. And against, against the, any of my, against, like, they did, they just used, like, Hyper Beam. I'm just gonna use Hyper Beam over and over again. That'll do it. Honestly, I also had a, a Tyranitar that knew, uh, Thunder, Blizzard, Fire Blast, and Earthquake. It was just so dumb. Like, I was just, like, I'm just gonna teach it all of the strongest moves and nothing can stop it. <laughs> yo, speaking of Blissey. Yo, speaking of... Everything. Prime kid strats, dude. A special T-Tar? I didn't know that that what stats did. Wow, that did a lot of damage, huh? Sing! It still hit. Let's go, baby. Okay, so now that we've used Sing, or maybe it was Sing, not Hypnosis. 
You get the gist, though. Um... Okay, we'll switch over to something else that can handle it. Maybe Ash? Oh, Ash knows the same moves. What was I thinking? Fling failed. Right, we're not holding items. Uh, Pretzel! Stay asleep. Thank you. Yo, cosmic power? Huge pogs, dude. Okay, metronome, please do something good for me. Don't flinch. Don't get confused. Oh, it's a wonderful day. Dragon Claw. That's pretty good. It's pretty good. Never mind. Snapped out of confusion. Metronome. Special move. Oh, God, that's going to do nothing. Yikes. Please. S like, thunder. 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 Thunder? Blizzard? Tickle. Started with the right letter, at least. Come on. No, don't do that to me. Wing attack. Sorry, Pretzel, but I think we just lost the... Oh, you survived! Snapped out of confusion, metronome? Vacuum wave? That sucks. Never mind. Okay. Wow, that's probably like 1 HP. Use next Pokemon, sure. Turn up. You're the only one that might be able to do, dam do damage here, buddy. Bubble Beam isn't bad. Air Cutter, though. Uh, oh, we survived. Okay. That actually did somewhat respectable damage. An honest bear, thanks to the prime. Uh, we're gonna hope we gotta get confused. We have milk drink, confuse ray. Okay. Please, please, Zoe. Yes. Drink that milk. One more milk. One more milk. Yes. All right. Some good milk. Uh, now we... I guess bide, probably, right? No, body slammed, paralyzed. Air cutter misses. Snapped out of confusion. Body slam paralysis. That would, that would make my day. I guess we don't even need to. As long as we survive one air cutter. Yeah, okay, no problem. Fantastic. That was just a random wild Pokemon, by the way. And here's another random wild Pokemon. Metatite Zoe. It's a Shinx. Zoe is a Shinx. Wait, we can roar to escape this battle. I can't run, but I can roar. Because I'm not allowed to run from wild, wild Pokemon. We gotta go through every battle. Make them work. Let's go. I'm glad I survived that random Golbat. Okay. I love this music. It gets so hype. Or is it the road above that has the hype music? I can't remember. Ah. Think I can sneak past? I think it's this one. Can you use Fluffy Tails? I don't have Fluffy Tails. Just wait. This is where it gets good. I 
It's so good. Loves the music, proceeds to speed it up. I didn't speed it up. It's not sped up at all. Why is Pokemon music so good? It's just, it's just incredible. It's just so good. I don't know. Uh, you probably don't have any moves for this, do you? Well, Bubble Bee might do something. Nope, it it won't. Turn up. You can take this. It doesn't know an ice type move. It's bluffing. It's bluffing. Ice dark. It doesn't know ice. We'll just dragon breath to take it out. See? Agility. Nothing. Should be a one-hit KO, maybe? No. Wow, Sneasel really took that, huh? And it does no nice move. Did no nice move. Why are you grinding? I'm not grinding. We're going to get the seventh badge. We're going to get the seventh. This isn't grinding. Chris, a bit. Thank you for the year, dude. Pog, my man. All right, is this the Electabuzz one or Electivire person? I think this is, at least in Platinum they are. Yo, you know what we could do? We could shuffle our team around until we get all three Regis and get Regigigas before the, before we beat the game. Right? <laughs> Liquid, thanks for the six months. And Hooker with a Phallus. Thank you for the Prime. That would take years? No, there's no way that would take years. What a name. What are the odds on that? That person subscribing or the, the whole Reggie thing? Yo, wait a minute, I have an idea. We can definitely do that. You can't go into the building? No? It's level one? Is Regigigas level one? He's level one in platinum. He's 70 in diamond. It's faster to grind for a shiny, I guarantee it's not. I have an idea. The odds of getting them in your party are very low. You'll see, I have uh, a very big brain strat. Not Seth, sorry for missing that prime, man. I have a huge brain strat that you guys have not considered. Okay. Just continue to attack. Sandstorm. I have my ways. Yeah, we might be able to get Regigigas. If, if, if it allows us to get Regigigas before post game, we might be able to. Pelipper. Yeah, we can take a Pelipper. The building is locked until post game. We'll see. We'll see. Thunderbolt. Beautiful. Here we go, pretzel. The odds of it happening are higher than you th than you think. Okay, we need to get um the the TM for like our HM for waterfall around here, I believe. Bit rate rip. Iron, good. Dan, thanks for the tier one. Appreciate it. Waterfall, hail. Nope. Okay. The temple cannot be entered without the national decks. Oh, really? Oh, rock climb. That's the one. Oh, saw me. 
We have a very low health Suicune. Isn't it a 0 0.006 chance? No, it's better than that. Uh, it's better than that. Waterfall is later? I guess it is. Zoe... Uh, you just don't have the health to handle this, Zoe. And honestly, this battle is gonna be pretty tough, so I'm gonna just... Stomp and hope for the best. Why did that double edge do so little? <gasps> what the heck? Dr. Redford, thanks to the five. Big Penguin Gustin, thanks to the subs as well. Just do the void glitch? I don't think you can just do the void glitch. Honestly, Bubble Beam will probably do the most. Right? Freed, thanks for the thousand bits, man. I appreciate it. Double edge. Alright. Ash is gonna finish this off now. Ash with the rollout, I guess. Oh, one more. Yikes. My speed fell. That kind of sucks. Keep going. Roll out. Okay, cosmic power. That just means Ash can get stronger with rollouts. Lucky chant. No crits. I don't need crits. We're just gonna roll out. Don't stop the rollout. Oh my god, it stopped the rollout. Is Stab actually a thing in Pokemon games? Yeah, same type of attack bonus. The little big guy, thanks to the tier one. We'll just pursue it now. Because apparently we're in love. Eh. Just smack the Clefairy, please. It's not even attacking. I'm just waiting for someone to go down. Did it just use Metronome Spore? I mean, all right. Metronome Sing, I'm already asleep. Uh, The Clefairy, you're gonna lose. What? Let me go, please. Okay, thank you for the sweet release of death, my goodness. Add sign, you got this. Ugh. Take down. Is this even gonna KO? It did. One health left. Easy, dude. No problem. Okay. Glaceon would choke. Not bad, Pokemon. This is the wrong side. Okay. I just want to go slow to listen to the music, because it's so good. Yo, this dude's crazy. This dude's crazy. He's going to see me. My incredible avoidance techniques. Check this out. Damn. Didn't even see me. And we're through the deep snow. And one more trainer. Okay. <sighs> They're gonna have a Snover. And I'm just gonna destroy it with my Machoke. Never mind. They have a Roselia. But that's okay. Because we have a Glaceon. It's not a problem at all. At sign. They are level 37. Grass whistle misses. Excellent. Hail. Glaceon doesn't get hit by. Uh, only Icy Wind. That's okay. Ingrains. That was a mistake. You should have attacked. Look at this damage. Boom. That's actually... Wow. That did way more damage than I thought. Okay. Snow cloak and hail. Do we have snow cloak? Do we? Huh. Glaceon special attack is pretty good, yeah? That's true, that's true. 
But it's an NC King. Will we switch? I, I mean... I guess we'll give Pretzel a chance to shine. What you got? What you got, Pretzel? You got, uh... A lot of different moves. I... Honestly, fighting moves, they're all the same to me. Let me check. Okay, so Seismic Toss will deal 32 damage. Revenge will deal 60, but all... And then it'll deal double if we get hit the same turn. That's 70. It's guaranteed to hit. That's 80, but 80 accuracy. I am going to Vital Throw and see if they're faster than me. Good. Vital Throw was the correct option there. Boom. That's not bad. And now Seeking will choose to attack. Seeking is going to choose to attack, so I'm going to Revenge on the Water Pulse. And now this deals 120 damage or something like that. Insane. That... Whoa, okay, that was a crit. Vital Throw's lower priority? Oh, well, that explains why we did less damage. Or, d attack second. This is fine, though. Vital Throw and Revenge always go last. So you're telling me that Pretzel might be faster? Let's check. Nope. Oh, it knows Peck. Huh. Okay. Well, Ad Sign exists. And Ad Sign is just gonna bite. Oh, it outspeeds me! Huh. It missed, which is nice. There we go. At sign levels up. Alright, Olivia's down. Olivia's down. We just need to get through now. Oh, God. Okay, Metacham versus At sign. At sign's pretty good, though. Honestly, this is a pretty good Pokemon to have. Uh, Bubble Beam. It missed high jump kick. Excellent. Uh huh. Hail damage. It psychs up nothing. Hail damage. It psychs up nothing. And. Done. Okay. Now, don't be a bad Pokemon. Okay. I just don't want to white out and have to go all the way back. It would take so long. First time here? What's up? Welcome, KH Collects. Be like a something that I can fight easily. That's a level 34 and over. Ah! Okay. Confuse rate to start. Uh, Psy Beam. Okay, Psy Beam did some damage. Psy Beam again. It snapped out of confusion to use Ingrain, this is fine. Side beam, take it out. Take it out, side beam. Da okay, use mist. Ingrain. Okay, we took it out. That's good. I just need to get to the Pokemon Center. Don't give me a crap Pokemon. No! Jiriki, thanks for the five. Oh god, I can't run. Please. Please. <sighs> you swagger, no big deal. We'll just catch it. I'm not I can't beat it. We'll just catch it. <laughs> we 
We have one more turn. Please. Please. Just catch it. Yes! Okay! <laughs> okay. Let's go. Give a nickname. Yup. What are we naming this? Who are we naming this after? Uh... Let's see, let's see. Uh... Um... Uh... XS Juice? I'm gonna name this one Juice. Juice. Okay. Put in your team, it's not highest level now. Okay, four squares. Oh god, we have a Bidoof. We have two Cresselias, and the one that's alive had to be a Bidoof. Yes! We made it! <laughs> okay. Okay. <sighs> All right. Bidoof with an emphasis on the oof. Yep. Okay. So, like... This challenge seems hella difficult. It's real fun. We have two legendary Pokemon. I'm pretty sure we're able to do the gym without ever fighting any trainers. One sec. I, let me just open up a video really quick. Oh, whoops, what did I drop? Oh, that's my TV remote. No, that's my Game Boy Advance. Okay. Uh, you guys can see enough of that. Uh, uh, okay. okay. This is the path we need to take. Perfect. Okay, and there shouldn't be any trainers here. We'll just do this. Uh... Wait, what? It's... It's different in Platinum. Oh, God. <sighs> okay. Uh... Huh. Well... This will be interesting to try and solve, I guess. Bring out the strawberry cursor, baby. Uh. I'm trying to see. Whoa. Okay, wait a minute. Wait a minute. This is one. This is one. How do they not see you? I'm just that good, man. I'm just that good. Okay. And we'll do this one. Oh. Okay. No trainers. No trainers. Get this. Get this one now. Okay, um... Uh, 
I see what we need to do now. How are they not? They just can't see me. That's all it is. Let me go up this way. I think we have to fight that one trainer on the side there. I'm not exactly sure though. Let's see. Here. Here maybe? How does he do it? I'm problem solving. Okay. Is it possible we... Uh... Yeah, we need to go from the platform above that person there. So we need to go down from... That trainer that's right there, I think. I think that's the only way. No, it's not the only way. No, it's not. Wait, we could do this. No, she looked back. Ah, I love that team. That was such a good team. I was going to try and take it into the leader. That's okay. The Cresselias have been wasted, dude. Thrown away. Sad, man. Ah. It's okay, I'll get three Cresselias next time. That would be nice. That would be quite nice. Hail continues to fall. Well, let's at, at least use the Cresselias. Okay, Ash, come on. Funland Palace, thanks for the Prime, and Excess Juice, thanks for the gift sub. Appreciate it. Used wood hammer, dear god. That does some damage. Oh, honestly, their moveset kind of sucks. Uh, Aurora Beam. Hit with recoil. Aurora Beam. Okay. Took that out. We defeated Brenna. Good. I guess our team is, like, somewhat acceptable now. It's not great. Uh, we have to stand up there. Ooh, okay. So we'll do that. Baba P. Thieves, thank you so much for the support. Okay. So, to land there, we need to do this, and this, and this. There we go. Awesome. I guess I I'm just gonna save in front and I'm just gonna give it a try. I'm just gonna we have two fire types. We have uh two fire types, Grumpig, pretty solid. Switch charge hard to the front. If I swap my team around, it gets re-randomized. We don't and we can't do that unless. It's for, like, actual reason. Okay, Snover to start. Zoe, Grumpig. Can you set up? I feel like Grumpig is a, a definitely a set upable Pokemon. Kind of. We're gonna start with Zen Headbutt. It leers. Alright. We're gonna Zen Headbutt now. There's Razor Leaf. Shouldn't take me out, right? Yeah, we could take one. Okay. Wow, that did nothing. I'm, it is over 10 levels above me. Yeah, it's 11 levels above me. That's fair. That's very fair. Um, I don't know. Magic Coat. It's, wait, we outspeed? Oh, no. Magic Coat outspeeds. Because, like, uh, we're not going to be able to hit it anyways. So maybe... Oh. Never mind. I definitely could have hit it. Okay. Emily, you know Fire Fang. Let's go. Emily outspeeds. Yes. Is that a one hit KO? That's gotta be a one hit KO. Yeah. Yeah. Emily, always so good. 
And Emily with the level. Badger, Badger, thanks for the prime. Emily wants to learn Slash. Probably better than Scary Face. Take some damage. Metacham. That would have been nice to have Zoe for. Um... Ash, maybe? Metacham is level 40. Okay. We're just gonna Aqua Ring. See what ha Oh god, it's bulking up. Um... Uh... I guess it has Ice Punch? No. It won't take me out, but it just keeps bulking up. And my... My Aqua Ring is... Oh no. My Aqua Ring is keeping me alive. But it, it keeps bulking up. Mmm, <laughs> that sign. You have a special move, right? Uh, shockwave, sure. Don't take me out in one hit, please. Ah! I should have taught Charizard fly. I didn't think I was gonna have to teach him fly. Yeah, um, smoke screen. It's the only way. It's the only way! Damn it! Turn up! Please. Please. Wait, it knows det it's gonna use detect! It did not use detect. It used ice punch. And it hit after a smoke screen. Okay. Okay. Yep. <laughs> Slash! Bucks up again. Crit! Hyper Potion, you've gotta be kidding me. Ice Punch Mist! Let's go. Slash crit? No. Why does she have a Metacham? Why does she have a Metacham? Well, now I know she has a Metacham, and I can teach this Moltres fly. Whoo! It knows Fire Spin. That kind of sucks. Um, let's get rid of... Honestly, Ancient Power. Pretty, I'm not even going to use Fire Spin, honestly. Uh, do we have anything at all? I guess... Ash can learn Flash Cannon. Is it worth it? Is it worth it? No? Alright. Oh yeah, I guess Ash is... Literally low health. Very low health. Alright. You know what is worth it, though? Um... Emily learning Toxic, I bet. Heal? I don't have any healing items. Alright. So we can just Toxic on the setup. Okay, so... Let's start by Thunder Waving this. Good. Okay, start with a Thunder Wave. Then we will switch out into Ash to take a hit. Avalanche, not a problem. Pretzel comes out. Alright, Pretzel. Uh, we're gonna try and get the boost with Ancient Power. And it's super effective too. It's a win-win. 
No boosts? That's fine. Avalanche. That wasn't even a crit? Boosts? Paralyzed? Okay, paralyzed. Hyper Potion. Give me the boosts. Give me the boosts. It's 120 base power. Oh, yeah, because it took damage that turn. That's fair. That's a crit. And the boosts. The boosts. Sure, Zoe. Get rid of Thundershock. Now continues to fall. Oh god, but it's then in Metacham. Let's switch into Emily. They might force palm, but I think Emily can take one hit. And it'll toxic right back. Ah, uh, should he Okay, this is fine. It did just double detect. It just double detected. It's just it's just hail stalling. Ice Punch, not very effective. How dumb. How dumb. Toxic hits. Alright, it's on a timer now, baby. Let's, uh... Rock Tomb to make it slower, I guess. Never mind. Let's, uh, change our Pokemon, then. Okay. So, now we send in Pretzel... To just... I mean, Pretzel's going down to hail. We read the detect, used fly. Hurt by poison. Missed a force palm. And we hit a fly. Okay, hail continues to fall. Sorry, Pretzel, you're going down to that. I uh, Zoe, I guess. Against the Sneasel. Let's cripple the Sneasel with Thunder Wave. You can survive one hit, right? No, you can't. No, you can't. Alright, turn up. What you got? Please have a good move of some kind somewhere. Swagger? Sure. Hit yourself. Oh, that's a one-hit KO, probably. It's not. Interesting. Uh, assurance, I guess. Well, it was a good attempt. I don't know what the heck at sign can do. Oh, he's already confused. It was a good attempt. Let's do it again. A Flareon, a fighting type. I'm gonna go and heal here. We could grind a little bit, yeah. But I'm not going to. Candace does that Metacham in Diamond and Pearl, yeah. I'm not grinding. I don't grind, guys. Juice, if I grab juice, our team gets randomized. All right. I'm grabbing juice. Move, who's our weakest? You know, level 11 Darkrai. Uh, where's juice? Juice! Zoe, you did good. Alright, you grabbed our juice. What do we got now? A level 34 Entei? With Ember. We'll try it, I guess. We'll 
try it. It's better than nothing, I s- Oh, we gotta do the puzzle again. Damn it. Alright. Not a big deal, but just takes a minute. Okay, go back here, there. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, should be good. Juice, thanks for the gift subs. Appreciate it. But the names fit so well with every mod. It's great, isn't it? Okay, do here, here, take this one. Oh, I already got that one. Uh, I took you out. We have one more snowball we have to remove. It should be just over this way. How do we take it out, though? Wait, how did we... Yeah, how did we get this? What? Oh, I see how we got this. Okay, never mind. We did this, we did that. Doesn't Volknor have an ambipom and an octillery? I don't know, dude. Boom, boom. And back to the start. What's the little panda symbol in the bottom left? I'm sponsored by Panda now. Okay. Now we have full health team. Now we'll be able to do it. Check this out. Easy. <clears throat> the only thing that's good about this team is the Entei. But I'm willing to try. I'm willing to try. Oh, you know, I guess Shuckle can be good. Shuckle can be good. Alright, Harden. 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 Harden! No! Undid my Harden! Juice, get hard! It's lowering my defense! What is it doing? My one weakness! Alright, alright, alright. Hail is falling, whatever. Turnip. We need to hope Ember KOs with Turnip. I mean, Ember is gonna be 160... No, 20 to 240 power, I think. It's a strong move. With the quad super effective. It might one hit KO. And it does. Beautiful. Alright, Hail can use Fall, whatever. A bomb of snow. We'll just stay in. Let's hope we outspeed with the Ember. KO it. Wait a minute. Oh, it doesn't even do half. Use Swagger. We outspeed. So I'm gonna switch. I'm gonna s hope it uses like wood hammer or something. All right. Fight. Gust. Avalanche. Sorry, Combi, but you're done. You're Garf, thanks to the seven. Yeah, okay, Combi's down. Not a problem. Turnip comes back out. Ember. This is fine. Wood hammer. Not very effective. Oh, it does a lot. But it takes recoil. I think we just ember now. Oh, it's gonna heal. That sucks. Yeah, she healed. Potion. Might be able to get a burn. Or a crit! Yo! <laughs> crit Hyrule! Sick! Alright. Alright. Hail continues to fall. Buffeted by the hail. But then in Sneasel, we'll switch. We'll switch for Sneasel. I just need to check this moveset. Bide. Ooh, okay, okay. Hmm. Uh, 
Alright. I have an idea. If we can get one Screech off, we can do some damage to the Sneasel. We just got a Screech. Hopefully. We missed Screech. We outsped to- no, Avalanche. Okay. Yikes. One hit KO me. Uh, Ash. Maybe Leer? Leer. Slashed in KO. Good. There's no way. It's just gonna hit me now, right? It taunts. I'll knock off. Sure. Uh, protect, I guess. Oh, I can't use Protect after taunt, right. Bubble Beam! We outspeed? Oh, use Avalanche. Okay. Alright, at sign. Come on. You're not allowed to heal? I don't have any healing items. Just gonna bide. Yo, okay. Okay. That's gonna do a good amount of damage. Right? Wow, that sucked. Never mind. Um... I guess we'll just bide again? It was a crit. Okay, whatever. Turn up, please. Turn up, 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 turn up. Outspeed, Ember. That's all I need to get it. It's, it's easy. It's easy, dude. It outspeeds? I that might not KO. Hail, took us out. Ah. All right, let's try again. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um. Yeah. Camera up Typhlosion, an Ice type, two Steel types, Typhlosion and Ca like, it's a pretty good team. Camera up, what do you got, what do you got? Fire type move. Lava Plume, dude. Yo. Okay. Shouldn't take me out, where defense is high, yeah. That's got a KO in one hit. There's no way it doesn't. Yeah. Okay, Hail can use the fall. Buffeted by the hail. Better send him a bomb of snow. Uh, we're not gonna be able to outspeed it. Wait, let's check what Turnip has. Check moves. Confuse Ray, Iron Defense, Extra Sensory. Oh, beautiful. Turnip, let's see what you got. We're gonna confuse it to start. Grass Whistle. Okay, so we grass whistled. I'm gonna safeguard so I can't grass whistle. It wood hammered. That's chill. Maybe I shouldn't safeguard because now it won't use grass whistle. That does so much damage though. It's too late now. Yeah, we don't have any steel type moves, unfortunately. We outspeed it with turnip? Okay, I guess it's really slow. It's interesting. Obama still flinched. Confused. No, use Avalanche. He used Avalanche. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. We did not outspeed. Let's send in Juice. I'm gonna try Lava Plume with Juice. Hopefully, it either is Confusion or it misses Woodhammer or it uses Avalanche. Use Woodhammer. It's hitting Confusion, though. I think this might KO it, because Lava Plume's a good move. Yes! That's the ace gone. 
Okay. But send in Metacham will we switch for sure. Uh, let's send in Ash. Okay, Metacham. Knows that bulk up. We're gonna confuse Ray though. Not a big deal. Use detect and failed. Confuse Ray. Uh, now we extra sensory. Hurt itself from confusion. That's good. That's a lot of damage. Oh, that's that's a pretty. Oh, that's a crit. I was like, that's a pretty good amount of damage, but it was a crit. Okay. Metacham hurt itself. Confusion again. Ash. Ash, though? Come on. It's close. No, it's not. What? What? Hail almost took it out, too. Potion. Yeah. Full restore. Gotta be kidding me, dude. Force palm? Just KOs? Jesus. Um. Doo -doo -doo -doo. We gotta save this one for the Sneasel. Uh, that's just gonna get taken out by the. Uh, we gotta hope Juice survives a hit or something or it tries to set up. Uh, I don't know what we can do against this Metacham right now. Yeah. You're in charge at sign. Gust, I guess. Yeah. Emily. Okay, hail damage will protect. Hopefully it doesn't set up. It used ice punch. Okay. Gonna hope for the freeze, I guess, and hope it doesn't force palm. I mean, that's good. That's actually really good that it used Protect, because that's more Ice damage. Yes, Ice Punch the Ice type. It's not an Ice type. Used Ice Punch. Oh, it Ice Punched me. Never mind, you're right. Yeah, sorry. I was... I'm Ice Fanging it. It's Ice Punching me. Tries to Ice Punch. That's neutral, right? No, that's not very effective. Why is it Ice Punching me? I don't know. We actually managed to get a hit in. Freeze, maybe? No, not quite. We healed using Ice Body. Okay. It's still using Ice Punch. Nice. It used Detect. Okay. It's gonna stall itself to death. It's literally stalling itself to death. <laughs> it did not run out of force palms. There's no way. It used like one. Now it bulks up. It, it threw. It threw. <laughs> it is a super effective move, and it never used it. Send in Sneasel. We'll keep battling. Um, headbutt, I guess. Yeah. Taunt, that's fine. It's a crit. All right. We're healing. Faint attack. That's not going to do too much. That did quite a lot. Slow. 
slowly healing. I'm just gonna protect. Oh, never mind. Can't use protect after the taunt. That's fair. It used taunt again. Okay. Huh. Hail continues to fall. We just need to KO it. Alright. It used Avalanche. Well, we won. <laughs> we defeated Candace. Would you look at that? Outplayed. Easy. And that is badge number seven. <laughs> no problem. That was like third try. Easy, dude. I have no idea what the Metacham was doing, though. Enzo, thanks for the prime. Well. Nice. Pretty damn good. Good job, pretzel. But honestly, like it it never attacked. Anyways. Has been about five hours today. We just got a seventh badge. I think that's a good stopping point. We'll have to beat this next week. Next Wednesday. If you enjoyed the stream, be sure to follow. I am doing Minecraft speedruns tomorrow all day. I'm going to PB tomorrow. That is what I want to do. That is what I will do. So if you want to watch that, or you want to watch next week, be sure to check in. Uh, but we will raid someone here. Who are we raiding? Is there anyone playing Pokemon Diamond or Pearl? There's probably no one, right? Yeah, almost nobody. Um... Looks like CJ is doing a Minecraft challenge. We're gonna raid CJ today. Thank you for watching, everybody. I appreciate it. I'll be back tomorrow. And, uh... Yeah, I hope you have wonderful, wonderful evenings or afternoons or mornings wherever you're at. Good stream, guys. Real good stream. Let's go!